change sound background. Oh. <laughs> Hey everybody, welcome to the stream. Hello, hello, welcome. I just realized that I still have my Strange Town background on for my Strange Town video I made today. I forgot to change it back to Pleasant Sims Blue. So we're gonna have a stream from Strange Town, sort of, kind of. <laughs> hey guys, welcome, welcome. Welcome, Christina. I hope this makes you feel a little bit better. And so today we are back in Pleasant View, guys. We are going to try to finish up the scripted events and hopefully get our Ben families moved in. I don't know if we're going to have enough time for all of that, but we're going to try. We got three hours. So let's just go hop on over to the game. Uh, let's see. I can remember how. There we go. Okay, so here we are in Pleasant View. I did make one little change to the neighborhood, and that is I went back to my Linden Tree defaults because they flicker a little bit when you're really zoomed out, but they just look so much nicer to me. Now, I'm going to have to either go in and replace all of these really poorly rendered crappy little trees, these old Maxis trees, because they look terrible next to the Linden Trees. So I'm going to be working on that, too. Hey, guys. Welcome. Welcome, everybody. Welcome. Oh, hey, Dylan. I haven't seen you in a while. Glad you could make it. Hey, guys. I'm so glad you all could come and join me today. We're going to have some more fun in Pleasant View. I'm so excited. I have my... I got my Diet Coke. Don't judge me. Don't judge me. <laughs> Hello, guys. Okay. I'm ready to play. I'm ready to play now. <laughs> I... I like Diet Coke, but I try to limit myself to like one a week because I don't, I don't know. It just feels wrong. Feels like a bad food to me. Feels like a bad thing to put in me, <laughs> but I like it. I usually, but I try not to have very much of it, but Mr. Pleasant was bringing me some dinner real fast from the worst place on earth. So, uh, I'm having my Diet Coke. <laughs> All right, so let's go and where are we? Where are we? What are we doing? We're doing broke family. <laughs> hydrate. Okay, I'll hydrate with my Diet Coke. I also have a water over there because I don't think I can drink this whole. This is a lot of Diet Coke. I probably won't be able to drink all this. I have a I have a bottle of water for when I get tired of the Diet Coke. Okay, so we're going back into the broke. That doesn't taste like diet. That tastes like Coke. Hmm, maybe I just can't tell the difference. All right, we're going in. We're going in. <laughs> oh, I'm glad you like the new video. I tried to make things real short and sweet there so we could get through all those scripted events. I'm glad you guys liked it. <laughs> maybe it's Coke Zero. I don't know if McDonald's has Coke Zero. It tastes, I don't, I can't tell. <laughs> They do? That must be what it is, because it doesn't taste like Diet Coke, but it doesn't quite taste like Coke either. You know what I mean? That must be what it is. Hey, Mindy. <laughs> Thank you. I love Coca-Cola. That's my favorite soda, but I never let myself drink it because it's just so, it's just the most worthless thing you could ever put in your body. You know, soda is, is terrible. I mean, diet soda is not that much better, to be honest, but it's a little bit better. Yes, please bring back. Please load up. Bring back? What am I saying? Yes, please load up your Sims 2 and play along with me. Ooh, I hate sparkling water. <laughs> the only soda I like is like a 7-Up and a Coke, but like I said, I don't let myself drink them. Why? This is taking a long time to load, isn't it? I feel like I've been talking about soda for 15 minutes. Okay, here we go. So last time that we played the Broke family, we had Brandy teach little Bo how to walk. That was the first thing to do. Now we're gonna wait for Dustin to get home from school. Brandy's gonna give him a lecture because he's doing really bad in school. And then he's gonna have his first kiss with Angela Pleasant. Then we're gonna age up Bo and then we'll be done with this household. So it sounds like it's not that much, but it takes longer than you think. <laughs> Oh, I hate Dr. Pepper. I hate it. It's just, it's like cough syrup. It reminds me of cough syrup. <laughs> yes, we did change Brandy's pants. Yes, we did. 
Oh man, I also like orange soda. Oh God, I do like soda. No, I don't want to be a so person who likes soda, but I don't drink it. Just, just putting that out there. <laughs> oh no, they only gave you 1080p. I'm sorry. Um, it, it's just hit or miss whether or not they give me the options. Uh, maybe it'll pop up here in a minute. So, Brandy, let's let's take a look at what we need to do to this kid. Oh, he needs to go to the bathroom. So, Brandy's also going to work on potty training, Bo. Get over here. And then she might need to clean this toilet, too. <laughs> I did. I did solve the Bella problem. I did that earlier today. Bella is gone. Bella is no longer with us. She's missing... She's out there in the ether. Who knows where she is? I know she's in Strange Town. She's not in Pleasant View. <laughs> hey, Mary, I'm so glad you could make it. So happy to see you back. You like Coke, Sprite, and Dr. Pepper. I just don't like Dr. Pepper. <laughs> Your sim got mad I didn't like Dr. Pepper. Oh, it's just, I, I used to drink a lot of Dr. Pepper when I was like a teenager, but I was also a sugar addict, so. Okay, empty that. Clean the toilet. Do your do your work, Brandy. Do your job. I feel like that's like really low. Orange Fanta. <laughs> I like Sun Kissed if I'm gonna have an orange soda. And let's check on Bo here. Oh my gosh, no, Melba. Isn't her name Melba? I think it's Melba. Melba, get out of here. You're not wanted here. Delete you. Oh, I gotta turn move objects on. You're out. You don't belong here. Oh, no. <laughs> not my dog, Bella. No, no. Not my dog, Bella. My dog, Bella, is here, and she is great. <laughs> I was talking about my, uh, not my. I was talking about Bella Goth. I don't judge. Soda is weird. It's a weird thing, and everybody has their opinion on it. And all I'm saying is I'm drinking my Diet Coke. <laughs> you came here for Brandy and Mortimer couple? Well, I think you're going to be sadly disappointed <laughs> because Brandy and Mortimer don't get together in my pleasant view. Okay, so Brandy is definitely prego. We're also waiting on her to get her baby bump. And because I'm using the clean templates, there is a chance that Brandy can have a girl or a boy and the child will also have Skip Broke's genetics. So we're not having a clone. Oh, 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 there she goes. There she goes. Oh, thank you for the follow, Best Simmer Justin. You're playing Sims 2 Pleasant View while watching a stream of Sims 2 Pleasant View? I feel that. I feel that. <laughs> Orange Fanta is the exception. Orange soda is good. It really is good. I have never had Brandy have a girl uh, on this pregnancy either, but I always hope that she will, and she never has for me. Have, have any of you guys ever had Brandy have a girl on this first pregnancy? I want to hear if you have. I know, now the toilet's dirty again. Hey, Marta. <laughs> Brandy had a girl in your game? Oh, no. You have to start over. Okay, I want to keep an eye on the child, too. So, Brandy, what is she doing? Is she eating? Go, go serve this pizza. She has to take care of herself before she can take care of the kid. So, I'm going to have her eat. She also needs comfort. Poor thing. I'm going to have her eat some pizza, and then we'll feed the baby. I will never use the triplets and quads mods. You guys are brave. You are brave having four toddlers. That's all I can say. <laughs> I will not. Oh, I haven't even thought about what we're going to name the baby. Oh, what are we going to name the baby? I'll probably... I, w I want to name the baby Bobby. You guys, I want to name the baby Bobby. <laughs> Would it be bad if we named the baby Bobby and we had our, our Bobby broke again? If it was a if it was a boy. If it was a... If it's a girl, I want to name her Betty. <laughs> I want to name him Bobby, but then I feel like we already had Bobby. Oh, we could do Bobby with an eye for a girl. Oh, that's a good idea, Em. That's a good idea. <laughs> I name 
this baby is an exception to my naming rules because I have an alphabetical naming rule, but Brandy's baby, I name after, oh, we gotta take care of this kid. I name after her uh, father, Bo Bob, newbie. Okay, no, feed your kid, feed your kid, feed your kid. I forgot how to feed the kid. Get bottle for Bo. <laughs> get bottle for Bo and we'll get him off of this. So I always imagine Bo, he's gonna be really talented in music because, oh, he doesn't have a music skill yet or a creativity skill yet, but he'll get one and his hobby is music and dance. Yes. So he's gonna get a lot of enthusiasm in that. Oh, thank you so much for the sub, Ashcroft Moon. Thank you, I appreciate that and welcome. Hello, hello. Thank you, Marcelinda, for those, for welcoming Ashcroft. <laughs> the Rogue family is hard. It is hard. Whenever I, uh, actually, whenever I made Fair Play, so, you know, it's just like the gender bent version of this. And then I, I finally got Mr. Pleasant to play because I was like, I made a custom neighborhood and I want you to play it. So I got him to play it for like two days. It was like a record. And he played the equivalent to the Broke family. And he was like, this is so hard. <laughs> <laughs> like I know he was really struggling with that one. Oh she oh is she gonna go okay here she goes she is gonna go and lecture him and here she goes oh no there's people everywhere that we need to give makeovers to oh crap there's Darren Dreamer oh my god there's Darren Dreamer and Brandy needs to meet him okay He's like, hey there, I see you uh, lecturing your son on the sidewalk. Nice, nice moves. <laughs> okay. I, I'm sorry, I can't really give you any tips on your game right now in the stream. But you're welcome to join our Discord and ask around in there. Okay, so what I want to do before we do that, because we have all these people right here that need some sidewalk makeovers, y'all. This is Brandy Letourneau, and I actually love that hair on her. That is cute. She just needs a little bit of makeup. Oh, come back here, Brandy. Thank you, Caleb. Yes, I posted. I don't know if you saw. I posted it in the mods channel in the Discord. I fixed the Discord uh, chat command. So you can just type exclamation point Discord, and it'll bring up the Discord link. Okay, is this? Here it goes. Yeah, I fixed it. I fixed it. I was working today. I was doing things. <laughs> okay, so let me get her. She is so pretty, y'all. Look how pretty she is. Ooh, I like her. We're gonna have to marry her into so somehow. We gotta get her jeans in here. <laughs> Whenever they have this eye shape, I kind of like really like this, this or this. Ooh, this one. I like this one. Oh, that might be too dark. That might be too dark. That one, perfect. Give her some eyeshadow. Gotta use some of my other shadows occasionally. And then I wanna give her like a lip that kind of matches her shirt. Oh, yes. Yes. She's so pretty. I'm ta I like it matte. I'm taking the shine off. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry that it's not giving us, uh, it's not giving you the options. Sorry about that. Um, also, oh, that reminds me, I'm gonna tell you guys, I am going to be putting the Twitch streams up on YouTube on my second channel, Pleasant Streams. So if you wanna subscribe to that, you can see all the playbacks there. The only downside is you don't see the chat. So there's nothing I can do about that, but I am uploading them there. I actually uploaded the first Pleasant View there, but it got stuck at 95% for like the past four hours. So I think I'm gonna have to re-upload it um, and it should be there tomorrow. I think I'm gonna do it overnight because it takes forever. <laughs> okay, there we go. And oh, come back here, come back here. I'm not done looking at you. I wanna look at her outfit. Her outfit's fine, I think. It's actually cute. We're gonna let her go, and then we have Angela. I love making over the Pleasant Girls. We're gonna do them really quick. Oh, Brandy, did you hear Brandy? Rawr, rawr, rawr. <laughs> She's still over there. Oh God, still over there. Which side is that? Sorry about that, I don't, sorry guys. 
I had more light in here earlier. I'm gonna have to turn up my light, so I'm sorry if you see that. <laughs> let's let's do this. <sighs> hey, can you turn up my light like a notch because my in it's it shadows on my green screen. She does. She looks so cute, doesn't she? I like it. There we go. <laughs> the illusion is shattered forever. No, no, down one. Too bright. Too bright. <laughs> Too bright. Okay, no. Too much. Too much. Up one. <laughs> okay, just that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I'm gonna shine like a bright diamond. Hold on. Do I look crazy bright? Do I look insane? <laughs> I didn't realize I was gonna lose the light from, uh, oh, hold on, I'm sorry. I can't stand this. Ah, it's still there. Okay, well, I'm sorry. You're just gonna have to deal with that. You're just gonna have to deal with that because there's nothing I can do. <laughs> All the pleasant family members are self-centered. I agree with that. Okay, so yeah, I think she looks so cute and innocent, doesn't she? Sorry I had to disrupt everything there for a second. Let's give her... I don't know, I kind of like actually really like that hair on her. I think I'll just do some blush. I don't want to give her too much because I don't feel like Angela would really wear all that much makeup. She's kind of like natural, but she needs some kind of eyelashes. <laughs> she needs something, but maybe just like these. Yeah, there we go. That's good enough. And then let's do just some lip gloss. I like doing gloss on my teenage girls. That's not really gloss. Although that does look cute on her. You didn't get a notification? Twitch is usually really good about sending out the notifications, so I don't know what's up with that. Oh, hey, Guppy! <laughs> now I'll know it's you! <laughs> oh, hydrate! Okay, hydrate. I don't think I'm really hydrating myself with Diet Coke, but... Alright. Let's see here. I did hear about it. I heard about it. I heard about the reality show. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> yeah, uh, Twitch is usually really good about sending out the notifications. I think I'm just gonna do that for her. I think I want her to look... Yeah, she's definitely that girl. And I like her dress, of course, because this is the dress I got to replace the dress that she normally has on. Oh, come here. Let me look at you. Let me make sure that looks good. I think I might have put too much blush on her, but it's okay. She, oh my god, she's so cute! Alright. One more. One more to go, and that's Darren Dreamer, which he's actually pretty good um, how he is right now. <laughs> Do you hear Brandy? Okay, wait. Did we not gussy him up? Come here. I don't know what I clicked. I thought I clicked Gussie up. Okay. Just not working on Darren. Oh, here it comes. <laughs> here it comes. And let's... I think his hair is good. I think I like his hair. All we're, all we're gonna do really is eyelashes. Which we can't even see his eyes, so whatever. It's good enough. Maybe we'll give him some different glasses, because God, I hate those green lenses. It would, like, suck really bad if you had to walk around with green lenses all the time. Let's give him something cuter. Okay, not those. Not those. <laughs> yeah, I'm still using the new hair system. Oh, see, that's so much nicer. I want to be able to see his eyes. He has really pretty dark blue eyes, and you can't see him. I like that better for him. I hate those stupid green lenses. Okay, we already did that. All right, Brandy, 
Brandy, get over here and greet this guy. He came up, you know what? He came up and waved at her, so I feel like that's an invitation to say hello. I don't feel that that's forcey. You know what I mean? He changed his eyes to brown. I like his eyes blue. Okay, did she greet him? Yes, she did, yes. They only have one bolt. Well, Brandy, don't know what to tell you there. <laughs> don't know what to tell you. Oh, the roads, yes. Thank you, I'm gonna add the roads, yes. Let's do that now. I forget about the roads. I realized in my Strange Town video, I didn't put roads on any of the houses. Where am I? Why am I going in build mode? <clears throat> so I hope I edited it well enough. Edited it. God, that's hard to say. Well enough that you couldn't tell too much. <laughs> All right. Let's do this. Let's do this. So much nicer. So much nicer. So we'll put this here and we'll change this to a to a um intersection here so when if you have to put one in an intersection you can change it like that there we go much better so brandy met darren so our next step now is to take dustin into the bedroom with angela i always take him in the bedroom because i feel like they would want to have some privacy you know they would have some privacy to have their first kiss which oh my god i forgot to lock it in i forgot to lock in his want to have his first kiss but anyway, he's going to have it anyway. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. She always goes in here and plays this. Um, we want to have kiss, first kiss. Get over here and have your first kiss, Angela. Oh, and they're going to look so cute with their defaults on too. Oh, look at this. I love it. I love it. Aww. They're just precious, having their first little teenage kiss. <laughs> Brandy does have a tacky fashion sense. Yes, she does. Oh, and they're in love now. They're in love. They're in love. Teenage love. Well, they have a crush, I guess. Thank you for the follow, PSA. I don't know how to say your name, but thank you. <laughs> I love them too. I love them so much together. Um, so let's see. What does he want to do now? He's going to say goodbye to Angela for now because we got enough going on here. And we got to check on the kid. And somebody needs to take him to the bathroom. Brandy, potty train Bo. I know you're trying to take him to bed, but you better potty train him first. <laughs> you think Dustin looks strange? Well, sorry. <laughs> I think he looks good. <clears throat> I know, I love the cutscenes too. Okay. Uh, no, Darren, you can't just come in here and use our dirty toilet. We gotta potty train this kid. Oh, she did, she left. Okay, that's weird. <laughs> Dustin's like, I mean, uh, Darren's like, I'm just gonna take a dump right here next to the baby. <laughs> Thanks, teeny boop boop. <laughs> he looks 12. Well, I mean, he is pretty much, he's pretty young. Um, he's like 12 or 13, he's like 13-ish. Okay, okay, Brandy, I see you. Oh my God, Brandy, we gotta take care of you, honey. I'm sorry, I've been neglecting you. Let's put the baby to bed. And then what can we, what can we do for you? Why don't you take a bath? Because you can get comfort and hygiene and then you can eat and then you can go to sleep. And Darren's just gonna hang out with Dustin, I guess. <laughs> Oh, she wants to flirt. Oh, oh. She doesn't feel good enough to flirt, though. God. Maybe we can get a flirt in before Darren leaves. <laughs> we'll try. We'll try. Wait, what just happened? Oh, she got her baby bump. She got her baby bump. Okay, but you... I know, I know, I know. Go take a, bu take a bubble bath. Jeez. Go take care of yourself, Brandy. Dang. <laughs> Is she going to get rejected? Um, maybe. She might, but she wants to go for it. She also fears being rejected, but sometimes you just have to put yourself out there and try, you know? <laughs> I know I love starting over a neighborhood. I love it. Yeah, I thought I wanted to do some music tonight. 
daydreamer. Um, her secondary aspiration is, did we do that last time? Oh, we didn't do it. I thought we did it last time. We didn't. So let's, I'm going to do that really quick. Um, let me pull up my calculator here. I thought we did that last time. And so Brandy, I am not giving her a college degree. She's like one of the few people that I don't give a college degree because I feel like she just had a kid right out of high school and she did not go to college. Um, where's my aspiration calculator? There it is. So I'll pull this. Let me um, do this. And we also need to look at her lifetime one as well. I forgot about that. So let me calculate her. <clears throat> I can't find my calculator now. I have like a whole bunch of windows open. Here we go. We'll calculate her secondary aspiration and then we'll look at her lifetime one and see if we need to change it. She usually has a pretty good one. And um, we'll see four, two, 10, zero, four, eight, eight, six, one, nine, three, three, two, ten nine six and two um we rolled a romance <laughs> okay romance for her secondary it is <laughs> <clears throat> that's gonna make things interesting family and romance they don't go hand in hand romance it is for brandy and then i'm gonna give her slower need and social and that ought to help too with her needs going down so fast. Yeah, she was a teen mom, exactly. And then we also need to spawn ACR on this lot and let's check her lifetime once. Become Captain Hero, no, no, I do not. That's not a good one for Brandy, I don't think. I don't know. She has no wants to get a job, so I'm changing it. I'm gonna change it. I'm gonna get a Sim Blender. If she wanted to get the job, I would let her keep it, but she doesn't. She just wants to have kids. We're gonna do cycle, no, roll. Reroll. No, oh God, I should have done this crap. I should have done this before I set the secondary aspiration because now it's gonna go through romance and family and I want her to have a family. There we go, marry off six children. That's perfect, marry off six children. And let me put that in my spreadsheet now. So she is a secondary romance and her lifetime want is marry off six children. Okay, perfect. Wait, did I put that on the right person? Yes. All right, back to the game now. We got, I think that's everything we need to take care of. Since she's not getting a college degree. Who is that, who, what? Did somebody just knock, uh, who knocked that over? Oh, Dustin probably did when he got mad because he got in trouble. But who is this? Hello, Sophie Miguel, you look so much better. Oh my God. Not casual. <laughs> We have to do a uh, change appearance so I can give her some makeup. Look how cute she looks. There's time before her croaks. Yeah, but I really hope that doesn't happen. I hate that raised 20 puppies want. Darren's just in there eating our pizza. Okay, let's do, let's give her some. Oh my gosh, no, that's way too. Do some of these little no 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 that's way too dark i think what else we got that's all we have oh, that one looks pretty cute on her skin tone broke family hundred baby challenge oh my gosh no <laughs> no brandy would be a good candidate for that i would never do the hundred baby challenge that sounds like just pure freaking torture to me <laughs> Oh no, that is not good eyeshadow for her at all. Let's give her a darker shadow. <laughs> Have any of you guys ever tried to do the 100 baby challenge in uh, The Sims 2? Let me know if you have, because I'm curious. 
I would never do it. It just doesn't sound that fun to me at all. But I know people have done it. You did it a long time ago. <laughs> I wouldn't want to raise 20 puppies in real life either. <laughs> yeah, Max, exactly. <laughs> you refuse to do it even in The Sims 4. It, it does, it looks exhausting. Oh, let's give you some Bruno. I, no, 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 I don't like those. Oh, I need to go eyelash shopping. I just use these Lilith ones all the time. Actually, those look really nice. <laughs> it's so hard in The Sims 2. I bet it would be. I bet it would be a lot harder in The Sims 2. And let's give her a little bit of lipstick. Mm, I don't like that color. No. I want something like the purple. No. I'll know it when I see it. So we also have to think about her outfit. Maybe I'll just give her some lip gloss. Oh no, that's way too light of a color for you. How about this? Nope. Nope. How about that? That's That looks good, actually. Maybe a light, lighter? Nope. I like that. That's like a natural lip. That looks really good. <laughs> no Sims deserve to be tortured with a hundred babies. <laughs> I like it. I think it looks cute on her. We could go one shade down on the blush, but then it looks like she has no blush on. I don't think we're maybe the no God no. Oh, oh wait, I see these. I didn't even try these. Let's try these. No, 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 and no. Oh, I need some blushes that look better on this uh, darker. Oh my God, no, absolutely not. Am I, am I layering this? Am I layering? Yes. Okay, that's why. That's why it looks so bad. <laughs> that's too pink. I just don't have a good, a really good blush. So I'm gonna give her, I guess we'll just give her that one. Uh, the asylum challenge without beds, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's look at her in the game. Oh, she's so pretty. Sophie, you are looking good, honey. All right, I'm gonna let you go on your way and then somebody needs to come clean this trash up before we get roaches, please. Thank you, please and thank you. Oh, it would, God, it would take so long to get 100 babies, jeez. <laughs> yeah, just study parenting. Oh. Brandy's in the bathtub. We'll feed her when she gets out. There goes Dina. We're trying I'm trying to right now I'm trying to get her uh hygiene and comfort up. Okay, Dustin. Okay. What do you Oh, you little jerk. Pick that back up. I saw you. I saw what you did. <laughs> All right. I don't know what to do with him now. He wants to earn money. Um, he goes to work. When does he go to work? On Tuesday. What are you laughing at, Darren? Okay, we gotta take care of Brandy. Brandy's not doing well at all. I don't think we're gonna be able to get a flirt in here, so I'm just gonna go back to locking in the potty train one. <laughs> Cause I don't think we're gonna get her to flirt. Uh, she's gonna go to the bathroom, she's gonna eat some pizza, and then she's gonna go to sleep. So the pizza, I don't think she'll fall asleep while she's eating it. Oh, she's going for the pizza first. Okay. And it looks like Darren and Dustin are getting along pretty well. That's good news. Dustin needs a good re male role model in his life. And I think Darren will be the one. He'll be the one for him. <laughs> uh, my Sims 2 is so beautiful because of lots of mods. I love playing Pleasant View. It's my favorite, obviously my favorite neighborhood. Yeah, she does have a really hard time with her pregnancy symptoms. She seems to be like one of the worst Sims. And I don't know if that's like partially coded in here for her to do worse or something. Um, Bo's gonna age up in one day. So we have one day left or maybe two. I think Bo ages up and then, and then she has the baby. Hey, Olya. Welcome. 
You had no idea she was pregnant when the first time you played this. <laughs> um, you just download the Sims 2 package and then you double click on it and it will install it into your game. So Brandy is going in, going to sleep. She didn't get to flirt with Darren. Darren's over here hanging out with Dustin. Uh, this is kind of strange. <laughs> Brandy just completely ignored him. <laughs> Yeah, if Strange Town was my favorite, I'd be Strange Sim. I should have... Oh, man. Missed opportunity. I should have been Strange Sims. I like that better. That's... Oh, that's got a ring to it. Somebody can use that. Somebody can use that name. That's a good name. <laughs> I love Strange Sims. I'm... I, that's it. I'm rebranding. You just call me Strange Sims from now on. Uh-oh, phone's ringing. Who is it? Oh, it's Angela. I forgot about this part. So Angela's going to call and ask Dustin if he wants to sneak out with her. And she, he's going to say yes. Yes. And then she's going to come pick him up in the stolen sports car. <laughs> All right. And he's probably going to get caught and go be arrested. But who knows? Oh, no. We got to check on the baby. Oh, he's fine. Baby's fine. Dustin, I'm just going to have him go ahead and go to sleep so that he gets a little bit of rest before Angela gets here to pick him up. <laughs> Mr. Strange. Oh, I love that, Marcelinda. <laughs> I love Mr. Strange. So Brandy can have 10 kids under one roof. Are you insane, Caleb? <laughs> Don't torture yourself. <laughs> I know I'm gonna go get I'm gonna go take all the strange sims names so nobody can have it. No, I'm just kidding <laughs> Belladonna sims is good, too. Yeah, I like that. I like that Um, okay, wait Darren, you know what Darren you need to go home. Okay, you need you just you're waking everybody up Just Brandy doesn't have time right now. She'll talk to you later. Thank you. Thank you for stopping by son. Now get out. <laughs> now Dustin, go back to sleep. <laughs> Spice Sims. <laughs> Spicy Sims. <laughs> I know, I don't know where that car comes from. I just imagine that Angela stole it from somewhere. Um, I don't really have an opinion on Veronaville. It's definitely my least favorite of the three base game neighborhoods. And I honestly haven't played it very much at all. Um, I am gonna play it eventually, though. I'm gonna give it a good, a good, uh, playthrough. Darren and Dustin have a bromance. I'm kind of glad, though. I'm kind of glad. <laughs> Seafoam Sims. Oh, that's perfect. See, there's so many good names. There's so many good names. <laughs> he wants to talk to the cute prego in the trailer. <laughs> oh, Clara. <laughs> I don't know about dead Sims. That one doesn't have that one doesn't have as nice of a ring to it. <laughs> um, you have to open up Create a Sim, and you have to click on the pre-made Sims button, and he'll be in there if you installed him properly. And you have to create him and create a Sim. Yeah, I would definitely add all of the family members from the bin. Definitely. Nobody's told me to save yet. You guys are slacking. You're slacking. <laughs> I'm gonna save now. I just don't, I don't know. Why is anything, anything? Why does anybody do anything? <laughs> Ronaville is just my least favorite. I don't know. I just don't care about the whole, I just don't care for the whole Shakespearean thing, I guess. Oh, gotta hydrate though, okay. But um, that's not saying it's a bad hood or anything. I just really haven't ever given it a chance because I just like um, Pleasant View so much better. Angela, what are you doing out here? You better go steal a car and get ready to come pick up Dustin. <laughs> it's just, oh, we got another townie though. Oh, we got Christy Stratton. I don't think we've made her over yet. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Oh, you want a commercial break? Okay, hold on just a second. Oh my gosh, look how good she looks, you guys. I'm in love with the skin. I love the skin. <laughs> she, 
she looks so good. And I'm, I'm also gonna let her keep this hair because that's cute. She's keeping it. I'm letting her keep it. <laughs> Let's put a little makeup on her. Just a little blush, a little... Can we put the Bruno lashes on you? Yes, we can. Little eyeshadow. I like that one, actually. I like River Blossom Hills, too. I do like that one. It does work really well with the hair. I agree. And then, so I want to give her something that kind of matches her dress up. Like, that actually looks really good. Let me see if I want it to be shiny or not. Sometimes I like it. Yeah, I actually like it shiny on her. Oh, you're so cute, Christy. You're so cute. She's going to be living in the apartment complex with Nina, too. Her hair looks like Tesla coils. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that sweatsuit. Oh, I know. It's so ugly. Haircut. Get yourself a haircut. <laughs> oh, pizza in the sky. Thank you so much for giving out the four gift subs. Um, thank you very much to giving the gift subs to Krista Baby, Steb, Natasha Una, and Deuce X. <laughs> thank you. I really appreciate that. And thanks to you, I hit my sub goal for the day. Thank you. <laughs> okay, guys. Let's... What are we doing? What are we doing? Oh, we have a hydrate. Did I hydrate already? I don't know. I'm going to hydrate again. <laughs> and I'm going to do a commercial break. So I was actually looking up commercials before the stream because I was like, oh my god, I'm all out of commercial ideas. What am I going to do? <laughs> So I think I might have found one that's good. Diet Coke doesn't count as hydrate. Okay, I'll drink water then. <laughs> there we go. There we go. How about that? <laughs> um, so I think I might have found one. Unless do you guys have any suggestions for our commercial break. And while we're thinking about it, I'm going to run really quick. I'm going to run a 30 second ad. So if you're not a subscriber, you're going to see a 30 second ad really helps me out if you stick around and watch it we won't do anything until it's over okay so i'm gonna set my timer and then i'm gonna look at yours oh my god it's 103 degrees outside i just looked at my phone it's 103 degrees that is hot it is hot in the desert okay really hot i'm gonna set my timer for 32 minutes let's see <laughs> ready my green blanket cover up <laughs> Look up the Lowell the Hammer Stanley commercial. Okay. <laughs> Water redeemables. Oh, I gotta save too. Okay, hold on. Let me save. Bury the Biscuit Boy. Okay, hold on, hold on. I am I will never show that Skittles commercial. That'll get me banned off Twitch. <laughs> okay, what did somebody say before? Lowell the Hammer or something? Let's see. Lowell the Hammer Stanley commercial. Oh, this looks good. This looks really good. <laughs> Let me get it prepared for you guys from 1999. 1999. This is a 30 second one, so we can watch another one too. Okay, here we go. All right, you guys ready for S Lowell the Hammer Stanley? Here we go. Okay, we don't need the intro here, dude. Injured? Is there anything wrong with wanting a huge Bad pile audio. of cash for your injuries? Of course not. You want the Scars. biggest, fattest money award possible. And that's just what Broken Lowell bones. the Hammer Stanley will go after. A big, fat cash award. Everything <laughs> legally possible. We'll hammer and squeeze for all the money we can as fast as we can. Lowell the Hammer Stanley. <laughs> four, five, nine, catch. Look at that four, font. five, nine, catch. We hammer and squeeze. <laughs> Did you see his face? He was so serious. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, it's a VHS audio. Yeah, it de that definitely was VHS. Yeah. <laughs> okay, what? Somebody else had a suggestion. Let me see. Bury the Biscuit Boy. Okay, I'm gonna trust that you guys are not giving me anything that's not fa that's you know it has to be family friendly. I don't know about Barry the Biscuit Boy. That could go either way. <laughs> uh, 
Okay, no, this doesn't look too bad. All right. Um, Barry the Biscuit Boy. We're gonna, this looks, this looks mighty creepy though. We're gonna watch this one. You ready? You ready? Freecreditreport.com. <laughs> it's a milk ad from the UK. Okay. <laughs> the Wonder Boner. <laughs> Barry Biscuit Boy sets out. Don't you don't think to splash about? <laughs> A lake of purest craven dale, first creamy, fresh, and cool and pale. Your mother warned him, <laughs> don't swim too long. He dips and dunks, but could go wrong. Oh, oh, Barry, oh, Barry. <laughs> so listen well to this milky oh. tale. You could lose your head over craven dale. Craven dale. <laughs> oh, that was good. That was good. But you know what? Now I want a cookie. <laughs> that was good, though. <laughs> Okay, commercial break over. That was a good one. <laughs> You're scared. It is a little bit disturbing, especially when they rebake his head and put it back on. <laughs> you can't put cookies back together like that. Max, you're ruining it. No. <laughs> okay, I hope you guys don't have nightmares of the Barry the Biscuit Boy. <laughs> oh boy, you're uncomfortable. <laughs> I like it. I like it. I, it's creepy and weird, and that's just what I like. <laughs> you were eating that. You were wa eating cookies while you were watching that. <laughs> Imagine waking up to that. I know. <laughs> You're sorry. No, it was good. It was good. I like it. I found what did, I found another one and now I can't remember what it was. Oh, I thought I had found the female version of the 80s dating montage. I found one. I was like, oh my god, this is it, this is it. And then it turned out it was fake. And I was like, well, that's not fun. I don't want to watch a fake one. It has to be real or it's just not as funny, you know? <laughs> oh, well, thank you. <laughs> You've had some weird dreams lately. <laughs> I always have weird dreams. Radio station salsa. Well, I don't have this music game music on it, so I forgot about that. <laughs> as soon as somebody wakes up, we'll turn it on. We'll turn it on. You meanie. <laughs> I knew somebody was going to do that. I, I meant to disable that since I was playing lo-fi tonight and I completely forgot. So we'll put it on salsa for like five minutes and then it's over. <laughs> I'm gonna have to pee. I gotta stop drinking the Diet Coke. It's like, it's like, a, it feels like a dessert to me. It's like so sweet. You had to cut your hair with a chef's knife. Oh my gosh. Now it's country. We have to do salsa and then we have to do country. I, I actually think country suits them pretty well. <laughs> okay, this is... I'm gonna speed this up because this is just... Here we go. Dustin's... Why are you getting up? Oh, he's completely rested. Alright, go take a bath while nobody's using the bathtub. And let's check on the baby too. Oh, he needs to go to the bathroom. Oh no, Dustin, get out. Get out. Get out. Brandy, go back to sleep. Uh oh. Brandy, go turn this. Go turn the radio on salsa, and then go back to sleep. Oh, she was gonna go turn it on anyway. That she was doing it on her own. She heard your request. She was like, "I'm gonna go turn on some sweet salsa music." <laughs> oh boy, she turned it on, but we can't hear it. So <laughs> I guess I have to go and uh, turn it back on. There we go. And then I have to turn my uh, Spotify. I'll pause my Spotify for a second. Okay. Are you happy? Are you happy? You're so evil. <laughs> oh, Dustin's sneaking out and Brandy isn't even gonna know. What? Wait, what is he doing? Oh no, he's going to kick the trash can. That's a good thing to do, Dustin. Really, really good there. Pick that up, pick that up. And Brandy, take your kid to the toilet. I always think it's just crazy how Brandy doesn't catch- she never catches him sneaking out. 
And it's like, really? How? Usually she's awake. She's like right there. He just walks past her, walks out the door. Like later, mom. <laughs> you wish there was a reggae, to sta a reggae station. I, I don't know why I snorted. <laughs> it is. It's so, it's too sweet for me too. I feel that way about regular soda too. Even the, um, the diet soda is like almost too sweet. <laughs> you think she's given up on Dustin? Yeah. She may have given up on him. <laughs> it reminds me of Dawn too, Cookies, and I think it's because every time when you play Dawn for the first time, he usually turns on the radio. Oh, here comes Angela. Dustin, go. Go. You gotta sneak out. Hurry up. Hurry up before Brandy gets out. I like to at least pretend that she doesn't see him for god's sake <laughs> all right brandy let's see what does the baby need what does the baby need um he needs just put him to bed what else can we do and then go change this to country and then we have to take care of brandy and see things get a little tricky especially when i'm trying to stream at the same time i have to be really careful about their needs and stuff so i'm gonna have brandy actually serve some food no yeah, she needs some food. We're just gonna have to have her serve some food. Go make a meatloaf in the middle of the night, Brandy. That's what you need at 1.30 in the morning is a meatloaf. <laughs> <laughs> it was getting crazy, Olya. <laughs> I know, my sims always succeed too. I wish they would get caught at least once. Okay, we're changing it to country now. We had our salsa, now we're going to country. It reminds you of when you bake a pizza at 3 a.m. I haven't done that in years. Years. You guys want to hear a gross story? So one time, I had, like, way too much to drink, okay? I was really young. I was in my 20s. I drank too much. What is this dog doing? I drank too much, and I came home. It was, like, 2 or 3 in the morning, and we had a frozen pizza. So I put the frozen pizza in the oven and I managed to cook it somehow, but I was like really drunk. And <laughs> viewership count plummets, I know. Then when I got it out of the oven, I got it into like the living room and I split and I dropped it on the floor face down. Like the cheese was on the carpet, but I wanted to eat the pizza anyway. So I just picked it off the ground and ate it. And it had a piece of dog food stuck to it. <laughs> and, it cr and I crunched it. <laughs> oh, it was. I, and then, then, I, then I was like, okay, I can't eat the pizza because, ooh. And yeah, that still haunts me to this day that I, uh, I, ate it. I didn't eat it, but I crunched into it. And then I spit it out. <laughs> I know, it was horrible. It was horrible. <laughs> you would do that? You do not need to see drunk me. It's just me, but like way louder. <laughs> I rarely ever drink. Um, the only time I drink is whenever I either go to a concert or to a family event, which is like a couple times a year. <laughs> if there are kids there, I'm probably gonna be drinking. <laughs> okay, so Brandy, she made her meatloaf, but did she eat it? I wasn't even paying attention. I was telling my dog food pizza story. Yeah, I know the trash will spawn cockroaches, but I mean, it's just inevitable for this family to get cockroaches. Oh no, it slid all the way back to the oven. Ooh, that's terrible. <laughs> Your uncle crunched into a dead cockroach in a cereal. Oh, that would haunt me for the rest of my life. I don't even think I could live through that. Who is this? Is that Daniel? Daniel! Oh, we gotta look at Daniel. <laughs> oh my gosh he's looking so cute god i love the skin so much the diet coke is making me like burp it's oh i don't like the i don't like the carbonation 
I mean, I like the carbonation, but I don't like what it does to me. Um, let's see here. We're going to give you some eyelashes, and we're pretty much done with you. Looking cute. Actually, you're going to get... Um, you're going to get some freckles. That's what I want to do to you. I want to give you some freckles. Oh, I should have given Angela freckles, too. I forgot. We'll have to do that when we get over there. There we go. Looking good, Daniel. Looking real good. Now move along. Move along. We're done here. <laughs> oh, gosh. I was way behind on the chat. <laughs> Your power is out. Uh-oh. Dustin got busted by the cops. I knew it. I knew he was going to get busted. And Brandy's like, whatever. This is just like a common occurrence here. <laughs> you give him blush that looks like red cheeks. Yeah, I like that too. <laughs> you ate a fish eyeball? Ooh. At least it didn't taste that too bad. Daniel's here because I guess he hates. Yeah, he's here to kick the trash can because he hates Dustin. I caught Dustin out making mischief. Whatever happened to responsible parenting? I don't know. It doesn't exist around here. Okay, Dustin, get inside. Actually, Dustin, your punishment is clean up the yard. Oh, wait, hold on. You have to clean up the yard, Dustin. That's what you have to do. I don't care if it's 4.30 in the morning. Clean it up. <laughs> Come here, I want to look at you. That's right. That's right. Oh, there was an earwig in your headphones? Oh, God, that would freak me out so bad. Okay, Brandy, um, why don't you put away the leftovers and go... Where's the kid? Where's the kid? Um, he needs a bottle, but Dustin can do that. You go do... You go do your thing. You go take a bubble bath. No, I have not ever had Rocky Mountain oysters, and I never will, is if I can help it. <laughs> oh, Natto? Oh, no, no, no. I can't. Not Natto? That's how I say it. I don't know if I'm saying it right, but ooh, no. I don't know. Brandy's an adult. I decided, guys, that I'm not going to be keeping up with their ages by day anymore, especially on the stream, because it's just too tedious. And I, it's just too tedious to keep up with. That's just, I don't know. I'm not doing it. <laughs> All right, Dustin, get in here. Now you have to take care of your brother as your second punishment. Get a bottle for Bo, and then you can go and then eat some meatloaf. <laughs> you got to get ready for school. Oh, I get leftovers. Um, I have no idea. I don't know what Confessions of a Teenage Drama Queen is, so I couldn't tell you. Maybe somebody else will know. I'm really, really afraid of spiders. Um, most bugs I'm okay with, but spiders, oh. I can't do it. Breakfast meatloaf, yum, yum, yum. <laughs> I can't handle them either. And we get a lot of spiders here. I'm constant. we get a lot of spiders in our bathroom. I'm constantly having to scream for Mr. Pleasant to come and get a spider out. You know what I want to get is one of those, have you ever seen those like little vacuums that suck up the bugs and then you can just go put them outside so you don't have to kill them i really want to get one of those <laughs> the stream is we're playing pleasant view okay dustin hurry up and turn this off god please turn it off <laughs> Prairie oysters. I don't know what that is. Hello to the UK. I've never heard of prairie oysters before. Okay, we've got to get the kid. When Brandy gets out, I'll have her take him to the bathroom and then potty train him again and then put him to bed. You have a spider in your bathroom, but he eats flies. I, I can't have a spider in my bathroom. I can't stand it. They just freak me out. I feel like they're going to jump on me. I don't know. I just have this, like, ingrained fear of them. Yeah, cockroaches are pretty awful, but I haven't seen a cockroach in, like, years, so I don't really have a... I guess maybe I would have a fear of them if I saw them more often. Okay, Brandy, are you doing what I told you to do? Dustin's just standing around. Dustin, 
why don't you go take a bath now and get ready for school? Don't you dare go kick that trash can. Don't you dare. Look, I couldn't even stop him. I couldn't even stop him. Nothing will stop him from kicking the trash can. Just, oh. Don't be a jerk, D Dustin. Don't be a jerk, okay? <laughs> yeah, you don't want to snack at all, right, Mary? <laughs> Oh, yeah, I bet you do, Anna. I bet you do see them in the storage. That seems like exactly the kind of place cockroaches would want to live. Well, you know what, Dustin? You're just going to have to wait now, okay? Go clean up your mess. Go clean up your mess. <gasps> oh, my gosh. Nothing's happening how I want it to happen. <laughs> I have seen a house centipede. Ooh, ooh, no, centipedes freak me out really bad, too. It's all those legs, you know? Let's check the baby. Um, He just needs social. And Brandy, oh my gosh, she needs fun. Can we play with him? Play with him. Will that give, you, will that give Brandy fun? Let's see. Let's find out. I know, he's always there to kick over the trash when you need him. I, the centipedes freak me out so bad. I don't know. There's just something so creepy crawly about him. <laughs> I know that's my life, right, Daydreamer? Nothing happens how you want it to happen. Bo's gonna age up today, though, at least. We got that going on. She's getting fun. She's getting a lot of fun from playing with him. A lot. Um, let's see. Oh! Oh! He, did he puke? Did he spit up on her? He did. Okay, put him in the bed. That's good enough. That's good enough. Put him in the bed. And go... I don't know. Go play pinball. I guess. She really needs some fun. She wants to flirt and ask a sim on a date, but there's just no way she can do that right now. We can barely keep her needs up. Afraid of butterflies. Okay, Dustin. Time to get out of the tub. You gotta go to school. Oh my gosh. There's just too much happening. Um, go answer the phone. Who is calling? It's probably Dina or Nina. I bet. Oh, no. It's Gordon King. No, Dustin's going to school, Gordon. Leave us alone. You're such a bad influence. I'm trying to play pinball. Who was that? Somebody just ran by, I think. Oh, look. It's Andrea Hogan. All right, Andrea. Prepare to be gussied. Prepare to be gussied up, Andrea. <laughs> Oh my gosh, Andrea, you look so cute. She's wearing an evening gown and she has this hair. So I don't know if we should change her hair or her dress because that just doesn't match. I think I'm going to change her hair because she just she just wears a dress. That's just what she does. We're just going to change her hair. I'm trying to think of how... Okay, I remember how her hair is initially. So we need to give her something kind of similar um, I don't like that. See, I like that, but I don't. I want it to cover up her ho her whole head because I don't feel like she would have like a shaved style. Oh, that doesn't look good. I don't feel like she would have like a shaved style. I don't feel like Andrea would be alternative. Um, oh, there, that's perfect. That is the hair that should have replaced the hair she had, right there. That's like the hairstyle that she had. And then let's give her... I don't even know if I can give you any blush because I don't know how it's going to look. Mm, I'm just not going to give her any blush, but I'm going to give her some eyelashes and some eyeshadow. I'm going to give you the darkest shade. That actually looks really pretty. It looks like she wants to see the manager. <laughs> she did kind of have Karen hair. I used to have this haircut, y'all. I used to have this haircut like back in... Before it was Karen hair, I used to have it, oh god, when was it, like 2012? I used to have this hair. <laughs> you did too? <laughs> I had it whenever it was, you know, it was actually an alternative style at first, and then it got taken over, uh, it got taken over by the Karens, so... I think when, once uh, Kate Goslin got the haircut, it was all over. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, well, I'm glad you could stop by, Ashcroft. And thank you for becoming a subscriber. <laughs> okay, let's see here. Oh, wait, did somebody ask me something? Oh, save game. Okay, I'll save as soon as I finish here. Good, good call. 
I want to give her some lipstick. Um, oh, no, that's way too light for her. I think I'll give her some kind of gloss. One of these glosses. No, that's too light. Too light. Oh, I like that. I like that one on her. It's just really natural. She's very pretty. The side, yeah, mine was longer. Yeah, mine came down to like right here. It was like, it went down like this. Like an asymm- a Ugh, my voice cracked like a teenage boy. It was like an asymmetrical bob. <laughs> it was, it was an edgy haircut when it, back then. Um, but yeah, I would never get that haircut again. Oh, no, oh, that's perfect. That's the one I want. That's the one I want for her. Looking good, Andrea. Looking good, and I'm gonna let you keep your evening gown since that's how you want to walk around town. Looking good. <laughs> I like her eyes, too. You were a freshman in high school in 2012. I was way older than that. <laughs> She is the ultimate Karen, isn't she, Sarah? Yeah. <laughs> a posh bob? I never heard of that one before. She is a classy lady. Yes, she is. Brandy, you're about to pass out, hun. Come out here. You got to clean up this mess and you can go to sleep. And let's hope that Bo goes to sleep pretty soon. He's pretty tired. He needs some social, but... He can sleep through it. I want to try to get him potty trained. I didn't see how close he was to getting potty trained before. t boss Who's talking about t boss <laughs> She looks like t boss Oh, she kind of does. <laughs> um, I use a whole bunch of mods. Um, you can go to my website at PleasantSims.com and click on mods and you can see all the mods I use. I have a neighborhood section. Um, that has all the mods I use that make my neighborhood look like this. I also have a tutorial on YouTube called How to Beautify Your Neighborhood that tells you how to use all the mods. <laughs> you guys are youngins. You're young. <laughs> you turned 30 this year, and it's not that bad. It's not that bad. <laughs> I feel no different. After I hit my 30s. I was like really freaked out when I hit 30. And I was really freaked out when I hit 35. And now I'm just like, eh. Whatever. I'm old. <laughs> I did. I had like... I don't know. I went through some weird stuff whenever I got into my 30s. But now I'm good with it. Now I accept it. <laughs> I know. I know I look young. It's because I don't have children. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to fast forward a little bit. Oh. You're 15, 16 in September? Yeah, you might be one of my younger viewers. <laughs> the majority of my viewers on YouTube, at least, oh, there goes Dawn, are 18 to 24, which really surprises me. But yeah, like 60% of my viewers are 18 to 24. Mm. <laughs> Oh, you're gonna be 25 and you're terrified. Oh my gosh, you're 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 so young. Don't be. I was a complete idiot throughout my whole entire 20s. I didn't even get my life together until I was like 29. <laughs> so, <laughs> thank you for the follow, Persitasia. I hope I said that right. <laughs> oh, I still get um, ID. For alcohol too but i haven't bought any alcohol in a long time you wish you could play sims 2 professionally i know it's awesome <laughs> baby face squad that's right you just turned 21 a few days ago well happy birthday i know for real i'm like what you're not gonna card me Am I starting to look old now? <laughs> I I don't want to tell you exactly how old I am just for, you know, privacy reasons, but I'm in my late 30s. <laughs> okay, the carpool for Dustin. Dustin, did you get home? The carpool will arrive in an hour. He's not even home from school. Dustin? 
Dustin, where are you? Oh my god, is the bus not gonna come? Oh, there it is. Jeez, I was getting freaked out. I thought the bus wasn't gonna show up. Oh, by the way, I want to turn the music back on. I forgot. Oh my god, Sabrina, that's a terrible thing for somebody to say. You had a Karen say to your face you didn't know they let 12-year-olds work here? Jeez. All right, Dustin, come in here and take care of your brother. Let's, he's gonna be aging up today. Um, he needs to go to the potty, so let's go potty train him. Watch Dustin end up being the one who potty trains him. Can we get Brandy up to do it? Never mind, Dustin, let's get Brandy up to do it because she's the one who wants to do it. So let's have Brandy potty train Bo. Oh, you found a mod that replaces the color of the school bus? I like the color of the school bus. <laughs> It looks like my school bus when I was a kid. <laughs> Thanks, oh Mike. Oh Mike, I, I can't read your name because it's in dark blue against black and it's really hard to read. They let 13 year olds work at Publix? What? Oh, Brandy, get up. Is that, is that in the UK? <clears throat> or is that here? I don't know what public. I know Publix is a grocery store, but I can't remember where it is. You always make the school bus white. <laughs> I like a yellow school bus. Well, I don't mind yellow as a color, but I just like it because it looks like the school bus is when I went to school. Oh, you've got them in Florida? You don't know about 13 year olds working there? I don't know what age you have to be to work here. I think you have to be 16 to work. Um, I know in my home state in the South, you could get a job at 14. Oh, thank you so much, Mindy. Thank you for this uh, resub. I appreciate that. Thank you. <laughs> That's why you change it. School was traumatic. Okay, I feel that. I feel that. <laughs> I totally feel school being traumatic because I'm a weirdo, so you can imagine. <laughs> Brandy, oh my god, Brandy wants to be friends with Darren. Oh, thank you, I almost missed it. Did she potty train this kid? He's still not potty trained. Uh, she's not, and she's in the green too, so I don't want to make him smart milk. I don't care, I'm, I'm locking in Darren. She has plenty of time to potty train more kids. <laughs> hey, Chrissy. Publix is trying to go nationwide. We don't have Publix here. And we have like Kroger affiliates and Safeway here. Aww, that's so cute. I love it when they throw them up in the air. Did she turn on the country music again? Turn that off, Brandy. We're trying to listen to lo-fi here. <laughs> you have to be 15 or 16. And you know, it may have changed like the laws may have changed, but when I was in high school, um, everybody couldn't wait till they were 14 so they could go work at Burger King. And I was like, screw that. <laughs> I'm not working. I didn't get a job when I was a teenager. <laughs> but now that I look back, I'm like, man, I should have got a job when I was a teenager. <laughs> metal, oh my goodness. You want her to listen to metal? Okay. Well, hold on. Let's see what she's doing and then I'll do it. Um, okay. Turn on. I guess I gotta turn the lo-fi off for middle. <laughs> Mariano's. Oh. Oh, yeah. Kroger bought them and the quality dropped. I see that. Okay, switch to metal. Sometimes I have Dustin listen to metal, but the metal station, like, starts to grate on me. So does the country station. <laughs> you haven't been to a Burger King in like a decade? You're not missing anything. At least the Burger King around here is bad. It is not good. <laughs> and they get all these safety violations all the time. I'm like, I'm not going there. Or not safety, but like health department violations. <laughs> I heard that Publix is a really good uh, grocery store. I, lo I love Trader Joe's, but we don't have a Trader Joe's. We have to drive like 45 minutes to get to a Trader Joe's. And sometimes we will make the trip and we'll just stock up on a bunch of stuff. 
Um, they have like really good frozen stuff, so we'll get a whole bunch of that. Oh. Okay, guys, I'm gonna run really quick. I'm gonna run a 30 second ad break. It really helps out the stream if you stick around and watch it. Nothing exciting will happen, and we'll be right back in 30 seconds. I think you should still be able to see me. Okay, we're just gonna be listening to metal. And Brandy. Oh, oh, she got her second baby bump. Bump. So that means tomorrow at Wednesday at like 6 30, right? She's gonna have her baby. And then we'll finally be able to move on to the next family. This one take I feel like this one takes the longest out of all the uh, scripted events, which I mean really we could have we could have went ahead and moved on, but I like to have her have the baby before we move on to the next house. I know their food and they're, that's true Natasha. They have really good vegan and vegetarian food and it is really inexpensive. <clears throat> I'm a workaholic too, but I don't like working for somebody else. <laughs> I work like 60 to 80 hours on my YouTube, but if I have to go like have a boss, I'm like, mm mm. <laughs> yeah, Trader Joe's is an Aldi. We don't have Aldi either here, which I'm really disappointed about. Can we take him to the potty again? We're, he's not going to get potty trained. Oh, let's see if we can try one more time. <laughs> yeah, Bo gets Bo is not in the same generation as Cassandra's daughter, so that probably will not happen. Nope, we don't have li little. I don't even know how to say that. How do you even say that? Light little. We don't have that either. We don't have any of those. We just have the Krogers and the Safeway, and then we have a Walmart, which. You don't want to buy any produce from there, I'll tell you that. It's awful. Um, oh, he got potty trained. Okay, awesome. I wasn't even paying attention. I was like, what happened? Oh, he got potty trained. <laughs> Yay, good for you, Bo. So now he's going to be in Platinum Aspiration whenever he ages up. I'm so happy. I think we'll just go ahead and do it right now. Let's just buy a cake and, and age him up. Or You know what? Let's let him age up. I don't know what I want to do. Let's do the cake. Let's do the cake. And then I will set his age all the way back. Here we go. Take him to the cake. Oh, not you. You. Take him to the cake. I don't know if we'll make it because we only have 40 minutes. You worked at Walmart for three months? Oh, I worked at Walmart for half a day. I got a job at Walmart and this was like in my early 20s or no, probably my mid 20s. Maybe my late 20s. I don't know. Sometime in my 20s. I got a job at Walmart. And this was whenever I was in school too. So I just wanted to do, have like a part-time job. And I went in for the orientation. And I walked out and never went back. Because it was so terrible. I knew I wouldn't be able to work there. Oh, thanks so much for the follow, Sims 4 lover. Oh my god, we're going to miss this. I got I to gotta zoom in. Um, because they were like giving us all this propaganda about how we uh, and they made us watch anti-union videos for like two hours and I was like this is weird and creepy and I do do not want to work here oh there we go Bo broke aged up to a child I can't wait to see him come over here come here come here let's have a look at you oh he's a miracle mite okay <laughs> Yeah, the whole anti-union, and I mean, it wasn't just like one little thing like, hey guys, we don't really do unions here. It was like a whole brainwashing campaign against unions. And I was like, this, this feels weird. So I'm out. <laughs> I'm out, guys. I don't think this is for me. And then I got a job as a waitress. And that was much better. Um, I want to, can I gussy him up so we can really look at his little face? Oh, he, is he one of those kids that runs everywhere? Oh my god, Brandy's gonna pee herself. Brandy, go, go, go. Dustin just earned 25 simoleons, so I'm gonna write that down. Um, uh, I'm gonna write that down right now because I like for my teens to be able to keep their money. So if he gets up to 100 before he goes to college, then he can take that with him. They can only take multiples of 100. But I'm gonna write down on my spreadsheet that he has 25 simoleons. And then, oh my gosh, look at this adorable child. Oh, does he have eyelashes? Oh, we already gave him eyelashes. 
What is he wearing? <laughs> they do that at Ross too. Yeah, I think it was probably legally iffy too, Heidi. Very weird. Oh, okay, sorry. Oh, Nick, you've seen the competitive reality show thing EA is advertising for The Sims 4, right? What a logical use of resources, right? You said it. You said it, buddy. <laughs> okay, so I want to go. What do I want to do? We want to see what he's wearing because it looks like he's wearing a suit. <laughs> Colt Mart. No kidding. Yes, he's a fancy boy. I'll have him go uh, change into his clothes. Not you. Um, change into your everyday. Now things are going to be a lot easier now that we don't have a toddler to take care of. And also, Bo is really neat and clean. If you guys remember, um, unlike his uh, brother and mother, he's actually really neat and clean. Well, I mean, more than they are anyway. And he's always cleaning up around the house, so that's going to be helpful. The Brokes can't afford a suit. I imagine it's a hand-me-down. I imagine that, you know, somebody gave them a trash bag full of hand-me-down clothes <laughs> and that's where he got his clothes oh my gosh that's so freaking cute i can't even look at this look at that oh <laughs> he's got a little chain wallet with his <laughs> he's got a chain wallet with his vest and tie <laughs> I don't even... that's hand-me-downs that's hand-me-downs Oh, Christina, you, Christina used her big flex. Christina, you're a shooting star. That's what you are. <laughs> oh, boy. That is something. That is something. <laughs> yeah, he wants to be better than his brother. I definitely see that. And he wants to get creativity level two, and he wants to make a friend. Um, I'm not really going to lock any of those in right now because they don't have an easel, and they don't have any money. I will have him go clean up these old bottles, though. Go clean up your baby trash. <laughs> oh, I got two save games. Okay, let's save. I'll save once for Delaney, and I'll save once for Mary. I'll save twice in a row. <laughs> yes, he's dapper. He's quite dapper. <laughs> he wears his church clothes all the time. He's going to clean that up, and then Dustin... Dustin needs to get some sleep. Dustin, why don't, well, I'm going to actually let him stay up as long as he possibly can so that he doesn't wake up in the middle of the night, if possible. We really need to, to have a look at Brandy now. And we can actually focus on her and her needs since she doesn't have a toddler to take care of. Their TV is broken, which I really don't care about because it's annoying that the baby sleeps in the living room and every time the TV comes on, it wakes up the baby. So I'm just going to leave it broken. Yeah. They still have watch pockets. Is that what those are, Max? Those are watch pockets? Seriously? Those little, or is that what those little tiny pockets are? <laughs> oh wait, did I miss something here? I think I must have missed something. <clears throat> oh, I gotta hydrate, I gotta hydrate. Hydrate with Diet Coke. It's not hydrating at all. Oh, I know. I, I've never worked in retail, but I imagine that it is the most awful thing ever. Um, I have been, I've been a waitress, but that's the only time I've ever worked in food service. And I, di I actually didn't mind being a waitress because I made pretty good money at it. Back in my younger and thinner days. <laughs> Strangerhood by Rooster Teeth. Um, I've heard of it, but I never watched it. And I only recently heard of it, too, because I was looking at something else about rooster teeth. Okay, get over here and eat some cake. That's what you need. That's what you need in the last trimester of your pregnancy is a whole lot of sugary cake. <laughs> it seems like retail would be like just asking to get chewed out by Karens all day, but I might be thinking the worst of it. <laughs> I did get good tips, yeah. Yeah, at least for the time. Um, I did waitressing when I was in my early 20s, and I could, at the time, this was really good. I could make like 120 to 150 
dollars on a Saturday morning because I did breakfast shift. And that was really good. This kid's running around everywhere. Oh, he needs to go take a bath. Okay, good for you. Good for you taking care of yourself. That's right, get that gestational diabetes. <laughs> okay, have another piece. One was not enough. One was not enough. When we get back to this family um, after the baby's born, then we'll be able to pursue uh, her friendship with Darren. I really like how it happened, like, so naturally. Sometimes I almost feel like I have to force it, and, you know, I don't like that. But he just came walking by, greeted her. They met each other. Now she wants to be friends with him. It just, it just, it's perfect. Just meant to be. <laughs> oh, man, that sounds awful, Daydreamer. That sounds awful. A man made you cry. Oh. <laughs> Your mom lasted half a day in Kmart and then immediately went into waitressing. Yep, that's exactly what happened to me with Walmart. But I actually did waitressing before Walmart, and then I did waitressing again after Walmart. Oh, the running thing is a bug? Oh, okay, I'll have to look into that. I, You know what I did that was the worst job I ever had? Was call center. Have any of you guys ever worked at a call center? That was the absolute worst thing. Talk about just sucking out your soul, man. Because people, they don't care. They don't see you as a human being. They see you as a representative for the company, and they're taking all their frustra frustrations with the company out on you. No, don't go break. Oh, we got to get him a bed. We got to get him a bed. Actually, I usually just have him sleep with Brandy. I don't know if that's weird. He's a kid. He's a kid. Okay, and Dustin, you need to go back to sleep, too. Sorry he woke you up. No, it's horrible. It's horrible. Um, it, it's awful. And they don't... They don't pay you nearly enough for the abuse you have to take. I got called every name in the book. I got... I broke down in tears probably on a weekly basis. Even though it, you know it's not personal towards you... But it feels personal when somebody's sitting there just cussing you out and telling you you're just a worthless piece of crap. And you can only take it for so long. You know? Yeah, it's awful. <laughs> so now whenever I have to call a call center, I am really, uh, I try to be really nice to the person because I know they're just doing, they're only doing what they can do. And if I get frustrated with like, you know, what they're telling me, I just say, you know, I appreciate that. Can I talk to your manager? Not in a caring way, in a nice way, because I know that's the way, the only way you can get anything done when you call those places. Oh. <laughs> you walked out at lunch and never went back? Yep. Yep. Yeah. Oh my god, Nikki. That's horrible. I'm not even going to repeat that on the stream. That is awful. <laughs> You told them you were the manager at the call center. <laughs> I am the manager. Well, let me talk to his boss. I am his boss. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, those jobs are so awful. Okay, Dustin's waking up here. Oh, my gosh. That's horrible, Clara. That's horrible. People are so cruel. You know, to people who are just trying to make a living, you know? Well, you're lucky, Olya. You're lucky. I've done a lot of jobs in my life. And I've disliked pretty much every one of them except for this one. <laughs> okay, Brandy, get out of there. Get out of there. I know you have to pee. One bathroom just is not enough for them. Like, I'm ready for Dustin to go to college or for Brandy to get married to Darren and move in with him. <laughs> I love that I'm doing what I love, too. It, it took me two years to get to this point. Two years of hard work. But it was worth it. Okay, what are we doing here? You're doing fine. He won't, Oh, he's going to go clean up because he's so sweet. I'll have to fix his running. I'll have to figure that out later. He wants to talk about his hobby. Go talk to your mom since she can't go in the bathroom. Talk about your hobby of music and dance to Brandy. She'll love to hear about it. Kaylin's in labor. Oh, my gosh. Oh, their bills are due. Aw, thanks for the follow, Crow Simmer. <laughs> and welcome. 
you've only ever done data entry i well one of the jobs that i actually did like before i had my last job was doing data entry and we could just like listen to audiobooks and listen to music all day i didn't have to talk to anybody that was one of the best that was probably my favorite job and we got paid by like how many documents we could we could do per hour so you could make a lot of money if you were fast and i was fast You just graduated college and desperately need a job. Oh, you poor thing. And this is a terrible time, too. That's good, Nikki. That's good. You put stickers on library books? That sounds like my kind of job. <laughs> That's right. I can type. I can type really fast. <laughs> All right, what's, what's happening here? And he wants to gain a skill point, play with Brandy. Okay, Brandy, Brandy's got to go to the bathroom right now. She's got to go. Dustin, get out. Get out of there. Her, get, get. I appreciate you cleaning the tub, but you got to go. You got to go. <laughs> oh, he's turning on the metal. Turn off the, no, turn it off. No. Oh, gosh. Brandy, turn it off. I want my lo-fi back. <laughs> That's right. Faster typing game. <laughs> you taught yourself to only, so you only use index finger on your left hand. Oh, no. <laughs> I, uh, well, I took typing classes in school, but I really learned how to type from exactly from uh, instant messenger and stuff from just like my on my own. But I did take... Um, I did take typing classes, so that helped me like learn the home row and all that. But I basically learned on my own. Also, my mom had a typewriter when I before I was in high school. When I was like in middle school, my mom had a typewriter, which I I would just sit there and type stuff. I would be like, "Mom, give me something to type," and she would just give me like some random document, and I would just type it. I just love to type. <laughs> you learn from Mavis Beacon. We had like some knockoff Mavis Beacon. We didn't even have Mavis Beacon. It was like. Learn to type for school 2.0 or something. <laughs> it's like really stupid. <laughs> Brandy, you need to eat. You you need to go go eat some meatloaf. Jeez, you're starving to death. Get off the pinball machine. <laughs> oh, okay. Thank you, Nick. I'll go check that out. I'll go get that. That's funny, Olya. <laughs> oh. I really didn't use MSN. I used uh, Yahoo and AOL Messenger were the big ones. Yahoo was really big. Well, AOL was really big, and then um, Yahoo got really big. I never really used MSN, though. <laughs> yeah, I had, I had a class it wasn't it was a typing class but they called it like technology or something like that some kind of technology class but all we did was learn how to type i loved the yahoo Ma messenger man i loved it i have such nostalgia when i think about that talking to all my friends on on yahoo messenger you could just meet random people which probably was not very safe looking back um, but i mean you just meet random people and chat with them <laughs> Yes, you gotta get those you gotta get those deep emotional song lyrics to put on your away message so everybody would know how edgy and deep you were. Yes. <laughs> you still have your AOL email, oh, that's so funny. <laughs> you were typing on an old school typewriter. I love typing on a typewriter. There's just something so satisfying about it. Oh, thank you so much for the resub, Nick. I appreciate that. Thank you. <laughs> Typing and using PowerPoint. Oh, I don't even think there was PowerPoint whenever I was in high school. Or if there was, we sure didn't learn it. Uh, why don't you go? You know what, Brandy? Please go clean this toilet. And then take a bath. And then you can eat. Um, we're just going to take care of her needs all day. We're ba basically right now, we're just waiting until like 630 until the baby's born. Oh, I hope we get a girl. I hope we get a girl, but we're probably going to get a boy. <laughs> Eat some more meatloaf. Actually, why don't you serve some more food? Because we're going to run out. So just serve. Serve some chili. 
They like meat in this household. All she makes is meatloaf and chili. <laughs> yeah, I, me too. I learned typing way better on my own than I did from any typing class as well. Smart boards. What the heck is that? We had those dry erase boards. We had some classes had chalkboards and some had the dry erase boards. And the dry erase boards were like so fancy and new when you got a classroom that had the like the markers. <laughs> I know I never have a girl with Brandy either. Brandy cannot come to the phone right now, okay? She wants to go on a date too. Oh, I'm just dying to get her in a romantic relationship. Oh, you want to compliment Pixel Plant? We haven't done a compliment in a while. Let's see here. Let me give you a compliment. <clears throat> oh, this is a good one, too. I say that every time, don't I? They're all good to me. Okay, Pixel Plant. The quietness of a manhole cover cannot compare with the wild vapors of nylon I sense in your larynx. <laughs> I don't know what that means. I don't know what that one means, okay? <laughs> I don't, what's a smart board? I don't know what that is. No dry race boards in your day, Mindy. <laughs> I, that's, that's beyond me. The smart boards is beyond me. I like the dry race boards. I can still smell the markers. I can still smell the markers. And you always have the dumb kid that like wants to sniff the markers. You know, it's like, dude, come on. Trying to get high off the marker fumes. <laughs> 10 out of 10 compliment? All right. You were that dumb kid. <laughs> oh. Smart boards were always broken. Sounds about right. Sounds about right. <laughs> Nobody knew how to use them. Okay, Brandy. Brandy, you're clean. You're clean enough. Get out. Go eat. Go make some chili. <laughs> oh really your mom can type with the typewriter but not that well on a pc hmm it didn't translate over huh i love i love chalkboards i like the smell of chalk i don't know there's just something like some kind of nostalgia for me if I don't keep up with my homework assignments, then I'm going to flunk out of school. And my boss says I'm only allowed to hold a part-time job if I keep on top of my studies. Okay, Dustin, you're going to get fired, buddy. But there's nothing I can do about it. Look, he's all mad. There's nothing I can do if you don't want to do your homework, okay? He wants to get into private school and go to college. Well, you're not getting into private school. Oh, I thought I got a mod that got rid of the private school want. Did I see a mod that got rid of the private school want? Does that exist? Or am I imagining things? Some teens do, but the fortune teens I find never do. He does want to earn money though, so we'll lock that one in for him. I know, leave that trash can alone. Um, okay, Brandy made some chili. Dustin, are you hungry? Come eat, eat some of your mother's chili before you go to work. Oh, he's crying, y'all. He's upset because he's doing bad in school, but he doesn't want to put any of the work in that it takes. <laughs> he doesn't want to put the work in to do better in school. He fears going to school, and he fears getting rejected from private school. You are not going to private school, Dustin. That is not in the cards for you. Oh, the fresh worm Xerox sheets. Yes, I love that, too. That's probably, so. it probably causes cancer or something, but yeah. <laughs> you know what smell I love? It's like my favorite smell. This sounds so weird, but I love the smell of hot concrete after a rain. You know that smell? It, it just reminds me of like school and being a kid, like pavement after a rain. I love it. <laughs> Can't get rejected if you never apply, yeah. Dustin, you better get to work. Go, go, go. You've had enough chili. <laughs> My teens don't usually fail. Some of them do and some of them don't. I'm I don't I don't ever force them to do homework. I let them fail. I let them all fail. <laughs> oh, you guys like that smell too? Okay, good. I'm glad it's not just me. 
she burnt this chili. She totally burnt this chili. Oh, Brandy. Oh, gross. Come on now. <laughs> Powdered milk replacer. That is an interesting one. <laughs> I don't know what you mean by what do I play on? You mean my computer? <laughs> I play on a computer. <laughs> And you used to sniff the markers at school. <laughs> Bo's grades are going up. Good for you, Bo. Good for you. Oh, and he wants to ask for homework. Let's ask uh, Brandy for homework help if she can. Oh, she's about to pass out. Maybe we can. Maybe we can. I don't think we're going to make it. Oh, the, uh, the whiteout. Oh, that's a strong smell. I can just, I can imagine the smell of that. Yeah. <laughs> the smell of a new car. I've had very few new cars in my life, so I don't really, I'm not that really nostalgic about the smell. I'm, I prefer the smell of an old beat up car. <laughs> okay, Brandy's going to sleep, so we're not going to get to do homework help, but I'll, he just wants to do his homework, so we'll have him do that um, until he runs out of fun. But Brandy's going to be giving birth here in just about like two hours. Um, she should be having the baby about 6, 6.30. The smell of Lowe's. <laughs> All Lowe's smell the same. I never thought about that, but they do. Oh, you like the gasoline. I do not like the smell of gas. I do not. It's just, oh, it gives me a headache. I don't like it. Oh, I love the smell of books, too. I love the smell of, like, a fresh paperback. Yes. The new car smells vinyl, yeah. Yeah, it is. My dad had a really, really old car from like the 60s and it had like this very distinctive smell. I don't know what they used to make the seats, but it had a very distinctive smell. I can still smell it. I don't know what it is, but it does, new cars don't smell like that. Well, he did some of his homework. That's good, but now he needs fun. Okay, oh, oh, baby's coming, baby's coming, guys. Yes, yes. Baby's coming, baby's coming. Come on, Brandy. Oh, your son, your little son is here. Poor Bo, he's gonna be traumatized. He just has to watch his mom give birth. <laughs> Um, well, for Brandy's baby, I always name him after Bob and Betty. So, this one doesn't count for the, uh, alphabet. This one doesn't count for the alphabet. Come on, be a girl. Be a girl. Oh, it's a girl. Holy crap. It's a girl, you guys. <gasps> it's a girl. It's a blonde-haired girl. Yes. 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 This is the first time this has ever happened to me. <gasps> it's the first time it's ever happened to me. No, I'm naming her Bobby. I'm naming her Bobby, B-O-B-B-I-E. <laughs> I'm naming her Bobby. Yes, Bobby Joe, Caleb. <laughs> Bobby Joe broke. <laughs> yes, yes. We're naming her Bobby Joe. Bobby Joe broke. Yes, I love it so much. I love it so much. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. She's so cute, I love her. I'm so happy. I can't believe we got a girl. We got a girl and she looks like Skip too with the blonde hair. And it looks like she has dark blue eyes too. <laughs> I'm so happy. I'm also really happy that my baby hair works because I didn't know if it was going to work with other skins, but it does. Woohoo. You're sad she's not named Betty. I had to go with Bo I had to go with Bobby. I had to go with Bobby Joe. And maybe she has another daughter we can name her Betty. Then we can have a Bobby and a Betty. <laughs> BJ for sure. <laughs> we could. We could. What am I trying to do? Okay, feed this child and put her... Oh, you can't just click on him and feed him. I have to go all the way to the fridge. Feed bottle to Bobby Joe. Cuddle Bobby Joe and put Bob Bobby Joe in the crib. And then we're going to be moving on. Oh, Dustin earned another 25 simoleons, so I'm going to write that down so he's got a total of 50 simoleons that are his and then we're just gonna get the baby all settled in oh my god she wants to get a job holy crap she wants to get a job 
That's crazy. Okay, yes, Dustin's very happy to have a little sister. Brandy, what are you doing? Go feed the child. Feed her. Okay, I will hydrate. I will hydrate. And then you can put her in the crib. I'm going to hydrate with water, though, because I'm getting real sick of the Diet Coke. <laughs> it does. It feels kind of weird, doesn't it? Well, you know what I'm going to do is I'm going to have her look for a job right now, so maybe we can fulfill both. As soon as she puts the baby in, we're going to look for a job now. Oh, there goes Nina. Hello, Nina. Nice to see you. Nice to see you walking by. I know so many firsts happening. It's awesome. Hey, okay. Let's find a job. Let's find a job. She's just going to take like whatever there is. Oh my God. I just, why did I do that? Full time. I just like shot all the way across the world. <laughs> Yeah, she realized she needed more money immediately. Okay, intelligence career. I don't think that really suits Brandy. Let's look again. Uh, child care as a nanny. Oh my God, that's perfect. That's perfect for her. She can be a nanny. Okay, let's just see what the other job is. I like to look at all of them before I decide. Um, Dance, no. Okay, we're gonna go with child care. Uh, come on, come on, find a job. You can go you can go take care of other people's kids for money. <laughs> but it's perfect for Brandy, isn't it? It is. Yeah, girls are expensive, right, Mindy? She always rolls a one to get a job. I don't remember her ever rolling. Maybe she does and I just don't remember it. Look again. But I don't remember her doing it. <laughs> take job 50 50 simoleons a day doesn't pay very much, but it will help out a lot. And she works 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. We're going to take that job. Child care. Um, she's a nanny. That's it. There's no, I don't think there's any levels or anything. I like the diaper. The diaper icon. Get a promotion. Can you get a, pro I don't know if you even can get a promotion in this job. Yeah, it's a, it's a custom job. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to write this down so I don't forget. And while I'm doing that, I'm going to run a 30 second ad break. Really helps the stream if you stick around and watch it. I'll be right back in 30 seconds. Okay, guys, I'm writing down that she has a job in the nanny career because it was just like the best thing for her to take. And I'm putting level, or it's a child care actually. And I'm putting level one nanny. I don't know if there are levels to this job. I think it might just be nanny because these are the NPC jobs. Um, but that's that's fine. All right. <laughs> oh yeah, and I'll save now too. Good good call. Good call. Yeah, childcare does is expensive, I've heard. I've heard from other people. <laughs> Okay, so I don't, we might keep looking and see if we can get her like a normal job because I got these NPC jobs um, for a specific purpose and it's not for my Sims to have them. And actually, I want to look at the part-time jobs real quick. I should have done that first. <laughs> oh, I got another hydrate. I want to have her look at the part-time jobs and just see if there's anything better. Because part-time would really work better for her, actually, with her having the baby. And I don't I don't really like to give uh, my Sims these NPC career jobs unless I'm doing it for story purposes. Oh, education! Oh, she's got to take this job. And at least she can get promoted in this job. She, I'm, I'm giving her this job. I changed my mind. I changed my mind. <laughs> yes. Take this. Okay, she's taking the education job. So now she's a playground monitor, and it's just a part-time job. So let me uh, put that in my spreadsheet real quick. Education, level one playground monitor. And I need to write down that it is part-time, too, so I remember that. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. 
I'm going to save again. And then we will be done with the broke household. So that took like almost the whole stream. It took a long time. That's always the longest one to get through. I don't think we're going to completely finish. But now it's time for us to go play the uh, Dreamers, which that one's really easy and it doesn't take very long at all to get through. And then we'll move on to the Pleasants. Maybe we can get at least those done. So I'll go out to the neighborhood. Oh, you want to do a commercial break? Okay, let me go out to the neighborhood first. And we'll do a commercial break. Who? Okay, what kind of commercial do you want to see? You guys have any ideas for, uh, yeah, we needed Wednesday for Pleasant View for sure. Free credit report, Wonder Boner. Okay, Wonder Boner was first, so I guess I'll look that one up. <laughs> Wonder Boner. I'm kind of scared of this. I think this is it. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I'm, I'm trusting you. <laughs> oh gosh, I'm trusting you on the Wonder Boner. <laughs> I know my search history, oh lord. <laughs> okay, here we go. Uh, let me show the screen to you guys. You ready? Here we go, Wonder Boner. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Who wants to clean and debone them? I'll do it. Ooh. What gives? You want to do it? Just wait till you see what I've got. <laughs> it's the Wonder Boner. <laughs> <laughs> the Wonder Boner? Oh, you laugh now. Just watch. You just assemble the Wonder Boner stainless steel rods like this. You take the fish, find the top of the spine, slide through the ring on the Wonder Boner, oh. and... Oh, oh God! Whoa. The Wonder Boner. My wife would like that. <laughs> Introducing the Wonder Boner, <laughs> the amazing new fishing the tool that makes deboning fish a breeze. The Wonder oh. Boner's unique design removes the bones from trout, shark, oh, and God. whitefish. Simply connect the appropriate size stainless Max. steel rods, start the spine <laughs> through the ring, and push the this fish through. It's that easy. Oh. And the Wonder Boner comes with a polyethylene storage case that doubles as a base the and a cutting Boner board. Was Why be? go through the hassle oh, of deboning a fish the old-fashioned way when the Wonder Boner makes oh, deboning Lord. fish this oh. easy? Well. I think the Wonder oh Boner is a winner. Oh. So, uh, hey, <laughs> when did you get the Wonder Boner? It's funny you oh, should ask. Man. Order your Wonder Boner now. Call 1-800-310-3039 and receive was, the amazing Wonder Boner watch. for just $19.95. The Wonder Boner comes complete with three stainless I mean, steel rod tops and two extension it's rods. And will oh, debone fish up to three pounds. The Wonder Boner is the perfect gift for your fishing friends Max, and your favorite chef. In fact, every tackle box and every kitchen should have the it's Wonder worse. Boner. Call 1-800-310-3039 and order your Wonder Boner for oh, only $19.95. Order your Wonder Boner. No, thank you. I think I'll pass. I think I'll pass on that. <laughs> I'll pass. Okay. What was the other one? <laughs> I'm so glad you loved it. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Cadbury Dairy Milk Bar. Okay, let's see. Cadbury Dairy Milk Bar. Wait, what was the rest? UK eyebrows. That's that's strange. That's a strange combination of words you just gave me. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, th okay. I, th I assume this is it. This one's older, though, so I'm gonna do this one. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna mute that ad real quick. <laughs> the Skittles commercial. Oh God. Oh, I was thinking about those sham wows earlier. The sham wows and the slap chops. Oh, those are funny. Oh, 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 oh. Hold on, hold on. There we go. Oh my god! <laughs> 
about the eyebrow dancing eyebrows now <laughs> they can do some of it but some of it was cgi okay i don't know but it was creepy whatever it was it was creepy guys <laughs> okay thank you for that commercial break i love watching these commercials <laughs> dumb ways to die is a commercial well you guys have a lot in store so that's good Wait, why is the music on? Did I turn, oh, I turned the music back on. Um, okay, I don't know what I'm doing. Let's go over to the dreamer household now and you guys keep keep those in mind for our next commercial break. We'll do like two at a time. Okay, so Darren Dreamer, Darren is pursuing his dream of being an artist while his son Dirk hits the books and Darren may have found his muse, but will his creativity be enough to win Cassandra's affection? Let's find out. It will not, but you know. <laughs> it will not. He's gonna have to settle for Brandy. But they end up being really happy together. I love them, Daydreamer. I love them. <laughs> that was terrifying. <laughs> okay, so here we have... Oh, wow. Darren just has job once? Okay, no, Darren. I'm sorry. That's not part of your story, okay? So we get our little message here. Darren wants to paint for a living, but does he have the skills to pay the bills? I feel like I'm I'm some kind of 90s sub commercial or something saying skills to pay the bills. Those past two statements are starting to pile up. So what we do is go have Darren paint a painting. That's pretty much it. This is like, the, I think the reason why people think the dreamers are so boring is because they have the most boring of the scripted events. It's just like, okay, paint a picture. Paint a picture and pay your bills and we're done. And it's it's kind of boring compared to the other families. Um, but we can make, we'll make them more interesting. We'll spice it up. The Melbourne Metro commercial. Yeah, I gave Bella the, be the death token. I did that before the stream. Um, and so she's gone. She is gone, hopefully. I haven't seen her, so I think it worked. <laughs> well, usually Cassandra and Darren end up having an affair no matter what I do. Like, I can't keep them apart. And as you can see, he is still in love with her. So who knows, you know? Who knows what's going to happen? Uh, our, they might change their minds and Darren ends up with, Cass with uh, Cassandra. Who knows? I just set them on their path fr from the beginning and then let them do what they want after that. <laughs> yeah, he only has one bolt with Brandy. That's it. I feel like usually they have more. Oh my God, Melba. Melba! Melba, where are you? Get out of here. Nobody wants you here. Take your wares and go elsewhere. Okay, so uh, Dirk just went to school. And Darren's going to stay here and paint all day. That's it. That's it. That's all we're going to do. So I'm just going to speed this along. <laughs> Melba's your favorite. I hate Melba. <laughs> Crush a commercial. I don't know that one. <laughs> no, I'm not forcing Melba to do the 100 baby challenge. Because I don't want to do the 100 baby challenge. Because that sounds like misery. It sounds like just absolute misery. I saw somebody else was doing the 100 Baby Challenge. It took them like 200 and something episodes to do it. And I was like, mm, I'm going to lose interest way before then. <laughs> way before then. Oh, thank you, Marcelinda. Yes, we forgot all about that. And we need to give him a degree as well. Oh, my gosh. Okay, first of all, Lifetime Want is not to become a cult leader. Jeez, Louise. No. Okay, no. Um, where are we gonna put this? Put that right there, I guess. I'll sell this plant. They need the money anyway. You can always sell off all Darren. Darren's like a hoarder. He has all this crap up here. 
you can sell it off if you have to. And we're gonna, what was I doing? Oh, lifetime want. So let's cycle the lifetime want. I want him to have the want of being a painter, but I don't think it's in the knowledge. I think I'm gonna have to give him like max out seven skills or something. Because I don't think we'll get I know like some of these uh, lifetime ones, I have mods that put them in different categories, but I don't think Painter is one of them. <laughs> oh, thank you for the follow, Lindsay. Let's see here. And of Poseidon. Oh my gosh, this gets really tedious. Actually, I can just let him keep painting while we're doing this. Why not? Cult leader. Okay, no, we're just going to have to give him max out seven skills. I don't know why uh, he has made a knowledge sim and a painter. It really doesn't make that much sense, but we're giving him max out seven skills. That's what I give to my knowledge sims that nothing else fits them because it's that's the only one that's not a job related one. You had your sim self married, Darren. <laughs> okay. Oh, you're right. You're right, Crow Simmer. Yeah, we can use the Sim Modder. We can. I hate doing it because it's so tedious, but we can do it. It makes more sense. Uh, okay. And the, also, the thing I don't like about this is you have to press play. I hate using this thing. You have to press play. Uh, let's see. Lifetime. Cycle through all lifetime ones every time so he can't paint like he has to sit here and just do it like do the action i hate it <laughs> okay come on stop stop what you're doing and do this and it could take like so long and you know what i might just like do this later because i i don't want to make you guys sit here and watch this because it can take a long time <laughs> it can take a really long time because he goes through every aspiration uh, so I'm going to set that later. I'm not going to make you guys watch that. We w I will give him that, that lifetime one. Or maybe I'll just go in Simpy and give it to him. That'd probably be way easier. I'll just do that. <laughs> um, I don't know. I remember seeing those BuzzFeed things. I never watched any of them. I don't know if she finished it or not. I found that annoying for some reason. Maybe it's just because I hate BuzzFeed. Okay, so he's gonna continue his painting and we're gonna go look at his other stuff. So I need to do his secondary aspiration, which I'm gonna do right now. Um, as soon as I find my calculator here. Let's see. So we'll do zero, two, seven, five, eight, Six zero three ten eight five nine six five zero five four seven, and we got knowledge. Okay, but he's already knowledge. So the next one we got is family. Oh, I love that. Yes, family. Yes. So he is a knowledge sim. I'm also giving him summon aliens, and then I'm giving him family. That's not family. Family. I love that. I love that for him. It's great. <laughs> Clara, yes. <laughs> Take this quiz to see what One Direction song represents your favorite color. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm so funny. Aw, thanks, Carson. <laughs> Hope you like it. And what's next? What's next? Lifetime one, I'm gonna take care of that later. Uh, oh, his college degree, his college degree. Okay, put, I'm just gonna put this right here for now. Can I put it over here? There's not another slot and I don't wanna mess with that. And we'll do upgrade sim, pre-uni, and I'm gonna give him an economics degree because he originally worked in business and then he quit his business job to pursue his painting career. So we're gonna give him an economics degree. Doesn't matter, he's never gonna use it again. Oh yes, and body hair, thank you, Marcelinda. Oh, big flex, Ashley. You're a shooting star. And body hair, body hair, body hair. Very good, very good. Now, I need you to change your clothes because I need to see this body hair I'm putting on you. So change into 
your swimwear. Okay, thank you. Oh, 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 come back, come back. Wow, looking good, Darren. Looking buff. <laughs> oh, where's my body hair controller? There it is. Add body hair. So I think I'm going to do like a lighter or maybe a medium set for him. Let's do set zero three. Oh, that works. I like that. I think that's the same one I gave to Dawn. I like that. Okay. Now you can continue wearing your swimwear while you paint. Be a weirdo. Be a freak, Darren. Be your true self. Paint all day in your swimwear. <laughs> Yeah, they, you're absolutely right about that, Max. Uh, oh, road overlay. Oh, my gosh, you guys. There's so much to do. You're absolutely right. They did rely on clickbait. And they still try to rely on clickbait, but it's not working too well for them. Or maybe it is. I don't know. It doesn't work on most people anymore. Let's do the roads. So many road pieces here. Oh, I see a townie. I see a townie who needs our help. Who are you? Is that Goopy? I think that's Goopy. Give it to me, Goopy. <laughs> it is Goopy. Goopy, why are you doing that? We gotta gussy you up, Goopy. <laughs> oh, wow, Max. That doesn't surprise me. Oh, Goopy. Even Goopy looks good with this skin. This skin is miraculous. It's a miracle. What can it not do? <laughs> it makes Goopy look good. Turn the music back on. <laughs> the title would be My Sim Died, not Clickbait. <laughs> I'll still do a clickbaity title, but it has to actually be what's in the video. You know what I mean? Like, I won't do one that's just completely irrelevant. Like, BuzzFeed. <laughs> you won't believe number eight! <laughs> oh, he looks so good! He looks so good! And actually, we've already done Goopy. We've already done him. Because he has eyelashes. <laughs> Never mind, Goopy, move along. Just wanted to look at your, your gorgeous face there. <laughs> Sims are so easy to kill, that's not even clickbait. <laughs> clickbait, Goopy looks good. You won't believe what Goopy looks like. <laughs> I did, I already gussied him. I already gussied him. He's gussied. Consider yourself gussied, Goopy. <laughs> oh God, dermatologist hater. This one thing, she did this one thing and lost 500 pounds overnight. <laughs> Doctors hate her. <laughs> I remember that one. Oh my god, somebody gave him heavy makeup and a wig? Oh, I need to I I'm never on the Sims 2 subreddit enough. I don't look I don't like to be on the Sims subreddit on my personal Reddit account that I like browse when I'm, you know, my personal Reddit. Um, because it always makes me want to comment on there and I don't want to comment. Because my, I made, I was so stupid when I created my Reddit account. I made it like my first initial last name because I thought I'm never going to comment on here. And now I comment all the time <laughs> and you can't change your username and I don't want to lose like a year's worth of my account. So I never want to go on there and comment on the Sims subreddit. So I only have the Sims subreddits on my Pleasant Sims account and I never go look at Reddit like on my desktop. You know what I mean? Oh, roasted, roasted, okay. Let me, I'm gonna save, just so we don't lose anything, and then I'll, I'll give you a roast. I'll give you a nice roast. We'll get Darren painting here. For your viewing pleasure, you can watch Darren paint, and I'll give you a roast. Okay, let's see here. She weigh it. <clears throat> Here's your roast. Your elbow patches rumble with a fear reminiscent of mayonnaise cradled in scotch guard. <laughs> Consider yourself roasted. <laughs> oh, I love them so much. I'm going to run out and then I don't know what I'm going to do. <laughs> I love Reddit. I, I go on Reddit constantly. I have it on my, it's like my go-to phone entertainment is Reddit. 
Scotch guard is the stuff that you put on furniture so that stuff when you spill stuff on it, it won't soak in and stain. That's what Scotch guard is. <laughs> All right, Darren, you're you go move along. Hurry up and finish this painting. Eureka, the nuances of creativity skill are suddenly much clearer to me. He has gained another creativity skill point. I'm hoping we can get this painting done before he pees his pants. He has no other skills in life besides creativity, which I find a little unrealistic. Oh my God, he wants to be friends with Brandy. Nobody, t nobody told me that. He wants to be friends with Brandy. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know. People don't want to cover up their couch, I guess. I, you know what I do is I have faux leather couches because I have animals. And faux, and I learned long ago that faux leather is so much better because you could just, anything that gets on it, you could just wipe it off. And then I don't have to worry about stains and crap on my couches. So I always have a black faux leather couch. Um, I don't put, Dar I don't like putting Darren in the artist career track unless he specifically wants to. If he wants, if he wants to just get a random job or if he wants to go in the artist career track, I will. Otherwise, I just make him a freelance painter because in my mind, he quit his corporate job and he doesn't really want to go back to having a boss. He wants to stay home and paint. But if he ever has the want to do it, I'll let him do it. You want a portrait of Darren in his swimwear? <laughs> I wonder if he could paint his own portrait. Okay, so we finished this. Uh, painting complete, so we're gonna sell it because he needs the money, even though I really like this painting. I like to hang this in my Sims houses, but he's gonna sell it. He can paint it again later. And then we get our little message. Still haven't found your artistic voice? Try painting a still life or a portrait of a family member to add a personal touch to your artwork. So I'm gonna do, I usually do a still life like of one of these statues or something just to get it out of the way. Um, I, I like taking, doing portraits of family members, but I hate that they have to pose. Um, I find it to be really inconvenient. So we're going to do a still life instead. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, he's still selling. He's still selling. Oh, actually, we need to send him to the bathroom real quick. And then we can start on the still life at, at least. <laughs> That's funny, Bexy. Yeah, we're playing the real thing here. <laughs> Me too, yeah. That's a good idea, Max. You could just do a still life of a sim. Yeah, that would be so much better. That's so much better. Paint still life. Uh, the portraits are just not worth doing. I completely agree. <laughs> Painting a portrait of yourself is an early selfie. Yeah, oh well, yeah, it is. <laughs> I like that. Painting a self-portrait does sound really hard. I could never do it. I can't even make a sim that looks like me. Oh, thank you for the follow, Nunu. Oh, look, Darren's, Darren's protected behind the light. We couldn't see him doing his business. Go do a still life of some sunflowers or something, I guess. Um, it's also, like, really hard to get... I don't care. We're going to sell this, so I really don't care what it looks like. Whatever. D that's fine. Paint that. Paint that. Some sunflowers. I guess I should have tried to make it, but we're going to have to sell this. He can paint. He can do a picture of himself later. Um, so I think Dirk just got home from school. Let's check on him. Oh, he's going to go play computer games. Oh, he got home. Oh, look, he wants to make out with Lilith. Yes, he almost always wants to uh, rolls this want to make out with Lilith, but he also wants to find a job. So I'm going to have him look for a job here and get something like in the business, in a business type of career. I really like business for him, but we'll take what we can get. Um, athletic. Let's keep looking. He'll mail it to Cassandra. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Aw, I like that. Painting portraits of them and, and hanging up uh, the portraits. I like that. Definitely not criminal. Yeah, I like intelligence for him, too. That's the one I like best after business. Law enforcement could work, too. Um, I like intelligence for him because his hobby is tinkering and handiness and you need handiness for intelligence. So it's a really good choice for him. Um, military, we're going to look again. Science, no. Is that all of them? Okay, I think we're going to take law enforcement. I think it's the closest thing to something that he would take. Yeah, the anti-Dustin, exactly. <laughs> Uh, okay, look again. I don't remember which one it was. 
yeah, I like to take the pictures, um, like the vacation photos too. I like the song. Okay, law enforcement, we're gonna take that. He's gonna start that tomorrow and now we're gonna invite Lilith over and I always do this same story, but I really like it because I feel like Lilith really feels at home here. And she feels so much better over at Darren and Dirk's house than she does at her own house. Like she doesn't have Angela bullying her. She doesn't have her parents fighting. They're just really welcoming and love having her over here. And she and Dirk get along so well too. Did we give Dirk eyelashes? And we can also give her a makeover when she gets over here. I love Dirk. <laughs> okay, she's gonna come right over. And really quick, I wanna gussy him up. And. Where are my male eyelashes? There they are. Give him some eyelashes. He's so cute too, the skin. It just does wonders for all these Sims. Look how adorable. He's looking right into my eyes. Did you see that? He was looking right at, like directly into my eyes. Oh, I both love and hate it when they do that. <laughs> yeah, the Pleasants are next. Oh, is he still wearing Max's hair? Oh crap, He. I, I didn't even notice. I didn't even notice he's still wearing Max's hair. Hold on. I don't know why, why is that hair not replaced? That is very strange, isn't it? Okay, well, let's give him a different hairstyle then. Let's give him something else. Oh God, not that one, no, no. I like this one. I like this one on Dirk. Um, but like, I wanna look around. I wanna just look around a little bit. Haircut. Oh, haircut. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> <laughs> I like that hair too, but I don't like that the texture doesn't match. I like this one. It's got some weird something going on there. Um, I might just give him this. I don't know. Oh, he looks cute in a beanie. I have the hardest time choosing hair for them. I really do. Okay, definitely not. Definitely not. Oh, that's so cute, but not for not for you. <sighs> not the Anthony haircut. I don't think he looks really good with bangs. Like, I don't want him to have bangs. Hmm. Sorry, guys. Give me one sec. I think I'm just going to go with that one that I like. Actually, that one looks cute. I think I'm just going to go with this one on the second page that I liked. Where did it go? Where did you go? No, not that one. That one looks like a werewolf hair, doesn't it? Looks like werewolf hair to me. No, where are you? Where are you hairstyle that I want and like? It must be on the third page. I think it's on the third page. The, I like him to have a little bit of a, I think I'm gonna give him this one. I'm gonna give him this one. Hi, Marcelinda. Thank you for joining us. Have a good night. Okay, we're giving him this one, guys, and I'm done. Now we're just waiting on Lilith to come over. Oh, there she is. Lilith is here. So the default replacements that I got for Lilith's outfit, I really like them, but I don't particularly like this color on her. I like to give her a different color of this outfit. So I'm going to do that, but I'll probably do that when we get over to her house. Right now, I'm just going to do her, her face. Oh, look how pretty she is. Oh my goodness. Now I do want to change her hair. I don't want her to have the same hair as Angela because I don't feel like they would have the same hairstyle. Um, I just think that they were limited on the base game hair. So that's why they had the same hairstyle. But I feel like Lilith would, I definitely always have to give Lilith like this hair. It just, she just has to have it. But I want the one that's parted on the other side. Like not that one, this one, maybe, no. Where's the hair I want for Lilith? Maybe it is that one. <sighs> Let me see. I have a really good one um, that I like to give her that's a pooklet hair, but I don't think anybody has done it. I don't think anybody has done that hair, particular hairstyle in this texture. 
It's one that's like half shaved head, but it's long on the side. And it looks really good. This is the one I like for her. This is the one I like for Lilith. So I like that. And then I'm going to change her makeup. So yeah, she had on some super dark blush there. And I want to give her definitely some pretty dark eyeshadow. Oh, I like that. Yes. I like that, and then I'm probably gonna give her black lipstick too. And let's see if we want it to shine. Yes, I love it, she looks so cute. <laughs> I feel like she just did her hair like that anyway, and like, what? Mar what's Mary Sue gonna do? You know, if she just went out and did it, there's nothing you can do but wait for it to grow back. That's what I did to my parents. I just went out and dyed my hair. I just went out and dyed my hair pink and stuff. I didn't care. <laughs> I love it. I like her red hair though. I, I don't like to dye her hair because I like her red hair. I also want to give her uh, freckles now that I'm thinking about it. Oh, she's so cute with freckles. I love it. Only I don't like that set on her. I don't like that either. Let me see which ones I want. I like that on her. There, she's perfect now, except for her outfit. Come here, come here, Lilith. Oh my gosh, there's Angela walking by. Did you see her scowling? Angela was scowling at her sister. Oh, she's so cute. She's so cute. And so is Angela. Look at her face. <laughs> she looks so angry. <laughs> I know this is my this is how I like Lilith the best <laughs> yes all right we do have some piercings that we could give to Lilith too but I'm gonna do that uh, when I get over to her house I guess I could have just done it there now I'll do it when we get over to her house and I'm also gonna change her outfit to when this like a, a black color because I just don't feel like she'd wear this brown and pink but right now, it doesn't matter. Right now, she's going to make out with Dirk. So, Dirk, get out here and greet Lilith and get your make out on. Angela, you keep moving along. Keep moving along. <laughs> yeah, Angela, I've already made over Angela, but she needs freckles. But I'll do that when we get over there. Oh, watered down Diet Coke. Blech, not, not very good. Okay, now make out. Make out, I say. Oh, she squeezed him. Aw, <laughs> so cute. I love these two together. I really hope they stay together through college. Uh, oh, they fell in love. They fell in love. Who is that? Benjamin. Oh, we already fixed up Benjamin. Nothing can, nothing can make Benjamin's nose look good, though. <laughs> Not even this beautiful skin. <laughs> you got overrun by redheads. 75% of the kids were redheads. Oh my goodness. Yeah. I'd have to take it out too then. <laughs> All right. Well, he got his want to woo to make out with Lilith and now he just wants to gain a body skill point. So that sounds like fun. Oh, where's Darren? We just abandoned him up here. <laughs> okay. He had to stop. Um, so let's go have him make some dinner this is usually exactly the same thing it always happens he goes and makes some dinner he's gonna serve some oh okay try to make mac and cheese please don't burn the house down though he has no cooking skill i'm taking a chance taking a chance <laughs> uh the freckles are from jesse j-e-s-s-i um, and she has a Tumblr, so you could probably just search something like, uh, oh, thanks for the follow, Danny. You could probably just search like Jesse Sims 2 Freckles or something like that, and I'm sure you'll find them. She also has some makeup that's really nice. <laughs> Misclicked. <laughs> you mean you didn't want to follow me? <laughs> I know what you mean. <laughs> I got you. <laughs> Brandy got pregnant by Dawn. Oh gosh. See, I've, I've heard of people doing that, but I would never do that unless they like just really wanted to do it. I wouldn't. Bye, Bryn. Thanks for stopping by. 
Okay. Yeah, no Yusuf in The Sims 2. Sorry. Yusuf's only in The Sims 3. <laughs> he didn't burn it. I'm like really surprised. So come on in and eat. Uh, actually, call call to meal. Oh, you can't do that. Okay. Well, come eat. What are you doing? Oh, they're out there kissing in the front yard. Go eat your macaroni that your father made for you. <laughs> Oh, 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 I'm pulling out my earbuds. I'm sorry. Brandy and John Burb always hook up in your game? I don't like that. No, I do not use lighting mods in The Sims 2. Uh, the game looks good because of the terrain replacements that I use. He does look good in dark blue. I agree with that. It matches his eyes, too. So he's going to eat. Lilith's going to play. What is Darren doing? I was... I always call Darren Dirk and Dirk Darren. I do the same thing with Alexander and Mortimer. I don't know why I do that. He's gonna eat. He needs some social. Oh, that's so sad. He's been up here painting all day, trying to pay the bills. Um, I guess we'll pay the bills too. Why not? Let's pay these bills. Oh no, you know what? Pay all bills. Pay all bills. And then I, we're pretty much done. I mean, really the only thing we have left to do here is for Darren to finish his painting. So I guess, I guess we'll let him finish his painting. And then we just have the pleasants to do and then moving in the burbs and the oldies, which I'm gonna be decorating their houses. I'm gonna do that off stream. I might actually even make a bonus video of that. Um, but I probably won't do, do too much of it on stream. Yeah, Brandy and John would be really compatible, but then I feel really bad about Jennifer, you know? Because Jennifer and John in my game, they are always faithful to each other and they always stay together for like their entire lives. I've never had them break up and I like it that way. I like to have one couple in Pleasant View that's not like sleeping around with half the town, you know? Okay, thank you for paying the bills, Darren. And you need some social. Oh my gosh, come in here and talk to somebody. Go talk to Lilith. She'll talk to you. She likes you. I don't really do speed builds and speed renovations. Um, if I make a video, it'll probably be for my channel members and it'll be like, I do a little bit of work and then I show them the progress and then I do a little bit more and I show them the progress. I don't like doing speed builds and stuff because I change my mind a lot whenever I'm building and I just don't like to show people my, my, my method. <laughs> Jennifer had an affair with Dustin Broke. Oh, that's just wrong. I don't like it. <laughs> now that you've seen Dirk and Cassandra, you can't see it. That's a horrible con. I hate that. I hate that that happens. I really do. Like, I partially want to start over The Sims 3 Pleasant View. <laughs> but I won't. I won't, because I don't want to go back through all that, having all those babies. I like to build and decorate, but it takes me a long, like I'm real choosy and I have to try a bunch of stuff out and just, I don't think it would make for a very good video is all I'm saying. <laughs> okay, how's your social? Not that great. What can we do to get social up faster? Impart knowledge, impart knowledge. No, don't impart knowledge. Don't do that. Um, oh, hang out. That's what we could do. No, oh God, no, not that menu. Can we not do hangout? I guess not. Oh yeah, it's right there. It's right there in front of my face. Hang out with Lilith in your swim trunks. That's not creepy. That's not creepy. We're not, yeah, we can see we can't. We can't start over because we can't lose Tony the Loser and Death by Puddle. We definitely can't lose Death by Puddle because I got merch, y'all. <laughs> I got merch for Death by Puddle coming. <laughs> <laughs> and also we have a uh, baby Olya and baby Jacob in there too that we can't lose so <laughs> yeah I'm still streaming Sims 3 not as often as Sims 2 but I still stream it um, we're ha I'm having a lot of fun in, in Sunset Valley I sometimes want to start it over but I'm not going to I have to stop myself because I'm always like it's not perfect I want to start completely over I'm really bad about that I have to tell myself not to do it. <laughs> Death by puddle, yes. Okay, so they're hanging out. What, where's, what's Dirk doing? 
He's playing computer games. He needs to start getting ready for bed. Let's have him go to the bathroom, take a shower. Then he can say goodbye to Lilith. And Dirk here, he needs to eat more. Go eat more macaroni. Nobody ate this bowl. He made a bowl for Lilith. She didn't even eat it. Okay, his social's up enough, though. Death by Puddle is your favorite band. I also want to get them to play a gig uh, at some point. They, do, they have to. We have to do that. Um, I do have a favorite pigtail hair, but I don't think I have it in the Sims in the new hair system. But it's the one that's like the low pigtails in front. I don't know what it's called, to be honest with you. I know it's so sad they broke up too. <laughs> oh, does somebody leave in? Oh, good night. I'm a good noodle. Have a good night. Thank you for stopping by and joining us. <laughs> The, look, Lilith and uh, Darren are getting along really well. I like that. I like that. Um, he's trying to hold hands with her. Now she's eating her macaroni. That's right. We invited you over for macaroni and we expect you to eat it. Her take of our hospitality. Okay, and then you, you know what? Say goodbye. And uh, once she's done, say goodbye because you have to go to sleep. You got to go to school and you got to go to your new job tomorrow, Dirk his new job in the law enforcement career as a school crossing guard. That's a good job for him, I think. <laughs> yeah, Lilith, please be my new dad pleasant, yeah. And somebody put these, put this away. We can't afford to lose this food. And you go to bed. And then tomorrow we'll just have Darren finish his painting and then we'll be done here for the time being. Oh, he needs a lot of work on his needs. Why don't you take a shower or go to the bathroom first, then take a shower, then go to sleep. That's good enough for me. <laughs> oh, I gotta have some water. The Diet Coke is getting gross. I like this music. It's kind of making me tired, though, I gotta be honest with you. <laughs> Yeah, I know. I like them together, too. I don't like it when they break up. Makes me sad. I was really hoping they would stay together in, in My Sims 3, but they just didn't. Story progression had other plans for them. Other terrible, horrible plans. <laughs> I don't like Dirk and Cassandra together, but it's like, oh, Sims 1 music. Okay. <laughs> Hold on. Let me uh, turn off Spotify. And we'll get Darren to turn on The Sims 1 music when he gets out. But yeah, I let them do what they what they do. And sometimes I don't like it. But it is interesting. It's definitely not a combination that I would have ever put together. <laughs> no, I do care about what they want. I care. It's more fun to me to let them do what they want, even if I don't like it, than it is for me to force them to do what I want. If that makes sense. Um, yeah, that's the fixed Pleasant View template, but if your scripts are not triggering, you probably have to regenerate a new Sims 2 folder altogether. Okay, he's turning it on. Now change to switch to shopping. No, did he just turn it off? Turn that back on. Switch to shopping and then go to sleep. This is what the people have demanded, Darren. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I do too. I really do. I love the music. It's great. Sims 1 has awesome music. I also love the music on SimCity 4. I'm going to save. Dustin Broke's second son just aged to a toddler. Aw. Two romance brokes. I swear I had a bunch of romance brokes too. And I think in my original Pleasant View. <laughs> in your dating profile, you're going to say you're into shopping music. I love that shopping channel. I only want somebody who wants to hang out and listen to shopping music with me. <laughs> okay. Uh, la, 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 la. Okay, everybody's asleep. I have to check. I have to check and see where I'm at. I'm just going to go on speed three. 
Oh, you thought it would be buy mode? Oh, you thought it was a Sims 2 buy mode? Yeah. <laughs> Dustin and Angela had a family son. Aww. Aaron needs to get tested. He has no taste. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. A school bus will arrive for Darren. Oh my gosh, it's like 7 o'clock in the morning. What are you doing? Oh, he's down here taking care of himself. Did you get some breakfast? Have some juice. That's not a very good breakfast, if you ask me, but whatever. <laughs> and then you... Oh, he wants to learn how to make cereal and toaster pastries. Which one gives you more? Oh, they're the same. Okay, let's go have some cereal then, since you don't have any cooking skill. Um, go have cereal. And then finish your painting so we can move on. And it also makes this family a lot more interesting once um, Brandy, once he and Brandy get married, which hopefully they will. Right now, they just want to be friends with each other. I don't force it. I just want it to happen, and usually it does. Yeah, that's true, Nick, but if your scripts are not working, then there's something wrong in your actual Sims 2 folder. You need to delete your entire Sims 2 folder and start the game and have it generate a new one, and then your scripted events will work again. And if you need help with that, if you don't understand what I'm saying, you can ask in the Discord. Okay, so all we're doing is waiting on you to... Okay, he's going to school. And Darren, you're welcome. I hope that makes sense. <laughs> Darren, eat your cereal and go paint and listen to shopping music. And I don't think we're going to, we're not definitely not going to get done with everything, but we're almost there. Continue painting your still life. Yeah, I don't care if he didn't do his homework. That's his choice. <laughs> Oh, goodness, Bexy. I don't know if I can read all that right now. <laughs> I'll try, since nobody else is chatting. Did, our, did everybody leave? <laughs> are, are you guys getting tired? I Lazlo woke me up at 5 o'clock this morning. And I couldn't go back to sleep. So I've just been awake this whole time. I thought I was going to take a nap this afternoon, but it did not happen. <laughs> You're here? Okay, good. <laughs> okay, I'm glad some of you guys are still here. <laughs> Your Brandy never wanted to get with anyone until she was an elder? I I hope my Brandy will. Um, she usually does. Usually she and Darren get together and it works out really well. <laughs> that's okay, Hulk. Yeah, that's okay. Lurk away, guys. Lurk away if you want to lurk. <laughs> I'm a lurker too only I don't watch streams so well that's not true I watch there's two streams I watch but they're not I don't watch sim streams because whenever I'm off whenever I'm off I don't want to do sim stuff and sometimes I'll play that's a lie I haven't really played on my own in a long time I'll work on my game some though Oh yeah, we can hit fast forward. I didn't even realize I still had it on first speed. Do, do, do. Oh, uh, crap. Oh my God, was that Sandy Broody? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on guys, we gotta do some, oh Sandy. Oh Sandy, why are you wearing these? I thought that I replaced these pants. Why are these pants still in my game? That's what I wanna know. Why are these pants here? <laughs> Why do I not have these replaced? Um, but we gotta do Sandy real quick. We have to give her a sidewalk makeover. Okay. Oh, he got a, a... Creativity skill point. I'm getting so tired, I can't even talk. Oh, Sandy, you look so pretty. Look how pretty she looks with the honey, honey skin. She needs to wear the animal print dress. Oh, she will. She will, but only when she's an elder. So it looks even trashier. <laughs> So the hair is perfect. All we have to do is give her a little makeup. And I think she would wear like way too much makeup. I think she would be, we're just going to cake it on her basically. Not that much. That's a little much. Um, let me see what I have here. 
Yeah. Definitely too much blush. We'll give her some big ol' eyelashes. <laughs> Get yourself an outfit. I don't want those. Let me find some better. Yes, way too much eyeshadow. <laughs> That's what you did to her? I don't have any blue eyeshadow. I have grayish. But that looks nice. And we want it to look a little bit garish. Um, because I hate color those colored eye eyeshadows. But maybe I should get some just for her. Now, where's the one I had on her? Now I lost it. Get yourself it. an outfit. Oh, get yourself an outfit. <laughs> no, that's not the one. Where's the one I had on her? Uh, I can't find it now. There it is. There it is. <laughs> yeah, she's definitely getting bright, bright red lips, too. Let me see. What's the brightest red that I, I think is this? Oh, my, yes. Yes. That is it. That is, I actually think she even needs a little bit of a darker blush, maybe. No, these are not. These are not it. These are not it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that might be a little, that might be a little over the top. I think I have to take that down a notch. It still looks pretty dark. <laughs> Yeah, we got to give her different clothes, too, because th I can't stand this. I can't. What she's wearing is so awful. Sandy, why? We're going to buy you a new outfit. Get yourself an outfit. <laughs> you can see her lips from space. <laughs> yeah, I agree with the whoever said the skimpy dress. I agree with that. Let's see what we can find for her. Just something, just, she just needs to be just skanky, you know what I mean? That's Sandy. <laughs> I love Sandy Broody. She's my favorite townie. Her and Benjamin Long are my favorites, probably. Uh, but I like to, I like to let her be herself. I like to let her, she needs to let it all hang out, if you know what I'm saying. Get yourself an outfit. Get yourself an outfit. <laughs> it's perfect. <laughs> Oh, oh, nobody's played the big overgrown monster yet. <laughs> I need to hear that every day. Uh, I think we need something a little bit skimpier than that. We definitely need something skimpier than that. Let's keep going. Let's keep looking. I think I have some down here towards the end, like maybe something kind of like what Dean is wearing. Get yourself an outfit. Get yourself an outfit. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Skanky and stanky. <laughs> oh boy, you guys. Uh, what else we got here? What else do we have? What else do we have? I think. Uh, no, that's too cute. It's too cute. <laughs> Goopy's your favorite townie. No hamsters. We needed no hamsters. <laughs> I still don't know what that means. Does anybody know what that means? Somebody please tell me what that means. Because I don't know. <laughs> I don't have anything like really skimpy. I got rid of all my skimpy clothes because I didn't want my Sims all dressing like skanks, you know? Maybe we'll have something. Oh, here. You know what? Here's something. Yes. That's what we need, Sandy. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. Oh, see? This is her young. This is her adult version. This is the adult version of her dress, okay? This is it. This is the one. I. This is it. I'm getting it. She's wearing it right now. Thank you. Oh, Sandy, looking good. <laughs> it's perfect. Hold on. Hold on. Hold up. Hold up, Sandy. Hold up. Come here. Come here. Let us, let us get a good look at you. Oh, my Lord, y'all. What have we done? <laughs> what have we done? <laughs> oh you think it was him part of him saying no pets i don't know i think he was i don't know i i want to believe it's something way funnier than that oh sandy sandy oh my hello hello <laughs> she does look like she works on the street corner <laughs> Oh, it's perfect.
perfect. This is how she was meant to be. This is how she was meant to be. Ooh, maximize creativity skill. Okay, Sandy, we'll send you on your way now. Thank you. Thank you for walking by today. Getting yourself all gussied up. <laughs> she does. She does. <laughs> Pets are okay, just no hamsters? No, I refuse to believe that that's it. It has to be something funnier than that. <laughs> it has to be. Yeah, it could be something like that, Shannon. Like he doesn't want a chubby faced big te tooth woman. <laughs> I guess he wouldn't like me. <laughs> oh man. Don will mo will definitely be getting him some of that. <laughs> Don will definitely get some Sandy. Get him some Sandy Bree. <laughs> you know he will. <laughs> Clara. A hamster was a drug. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna look it up. I'm gonna research this. I'm gonna research this and try to find out what it means. <laughs> she is a mess. She's a mess, but I love her. I love her. <laughs> Women who keep their food in their cheeks. <laughs> oh god. Dawn's pro hamster, you think? Okay, I don't know if we're gonna... Let's see. Let's hurry up and get through this. Dirk's going off to school. And maybe we can get to the Pleasants right at the end. Okay, he's done. Look at this painting. So good, Darren. So good. Go sell that. Ooh, 217. Yes. <laughs> Sandy Cheeks. <laughs> I will. I'll tell you what I find out. I'll tell you what I find out. Hopefully it's something good. <laughs> I mean, not good, but funny. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Okay, we're done here. Our work is done. We're going to save. We're going to move it along. We're going to move it along to the Pleasants. And see, we could. We probably have time to get the whole uh, Pleasant scenario out of the way. If we hurry. Did I save? I don't remember. Probably. I probably just saved twice in a row. You can never save too much. That's my motto. Never save too much. <laughs> hamster. Without overarching purpose or point like a hamster running in a wheel. Well, that can't be it. It's got to be something better than that. <laughs> it's got to be better than that. Ugh. I, I would rather believe it's a chubby face big tooth woman. <laughs> I know that definition is way too smart for him. Yes, I agree. <sighs> okay, we're going to the Pleasants. We're going to, where are you, Pleasants? Jeez, I can't find you. On the surface, Daniel and Mary Sue Pleasant seem to have the perfect life, but is their love a flimsy facade? And can Angela and Lilith make the right choices when it comes to love? Yes, they can. Yes to both. <laughs> Uh, the guy on the dating montage said that he didn't want any hamsters. So we were trying to figure out what he meant by that. No hamsters, he said. Okay, so first thing when we load the Pleasant family, um, usually Daniel and Mary Sue go autonomously kiss each other, which increases their relationship. Mary Sue wants to get a promotion. We need to do some makeovers here real quick. So... I need to ch fix Mary Sue because she doesn't have, yeah, she does. Her hair, is that hair replaced? I think it is. I think it is because I don't remember her having those little things on the side. Yeah, I think so. She's got a five head though. Jeez. <laughs> you sent your fiance for hoagies at 945. Oh man, I want hoagies. I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm always hungry by the time I finish the stream because on streaming days, I usually don't eat anything before the stream because I'm so busy getting ready. So then I'm like starving by the end of it. We're going to do her makeup. Look how cute her eyes look. Gosh, this, I'm, I just cannot get over how much I love this skin. I think I want to do the Bruno eyelashes on. Oh no, I don't like how that looks on the side. We might give her one of the less dramatic ones like, oh no. 
I'm just gonna give her that one because it's like really hard to find a eyelash that fits her eye shape. What? What are you, hamster? Oh, I bet that's what it is. That's what it is. That's it, Sabrina found it. An acronym used to describe a young female who has one or more meaningless jobs. They start with H-A-M-S-T-E-R, hair stylist, hostess, actress, assistant, model, musician, stripper, secretary, technician, teller, entertainer, exotic dancer, receptionist, run, runaway? I don't think runaway is a job. Um, and some of those are perfectly fine jobs. Like, okay, I get stripper, but there's nothing wrong with being a hostess or a secretary or an assistant. Like, what? That dude... There's no wonder he didn't get it. He, I'm sure he didn't get a date. <laughs> he didn't get a date. <laughs> I think it's way too smart for him, but I don't think that he would not repeat that. I don't think that, I think that he would have heard that and then repeated it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> There's nothing wrong with being a stripper if that's what you want to do, but I could understand that like old conservative man saying that. Is what I'm is what I meant by that, um, but I didn't understand why he would say like you can't be a bank teller. Like really, dude, that's how you're gonna be. <laughs> yeah, he was a misogynist, definitely, definitely, definitely. Okay, back to Mary Sue, really quick. I want to finish her makeup here. That I'm glad you found it. You found the the answer that inquiring minds want to know. <laughs> A dirty hamster was the turn. Oh my god! Yeah, he wants to date a hot rich lady, and I don't think he's gonna find that. <laughs> All right, come on now. Let's do some. I like to do for Mary Sue. I like to do a very light lip gloss like this. I don't think she would wear too much makeup because she is in the political career and she has to look kind of, you know, respectable. None of these blushes are, like, really showing up on her very much. They're very light. I think I'll give her that one. Okay, Mary Sue is ready. She's ready to go. Uh, Daniel, I, I gave him freckles, but I didn't give Angela freckles, so I want to do that really quick. And then Lilith, I want to change her outfit, and then we'll be done. And then, okay, oh, and also we get our message that says, Who says good help is hard to find? Daniel has his eye on the maid and wants a little romance, but will his decision threaten family unity? Yes, it will. It will indeed. <laughs> uh, let's change appearance, give you your freckles. Oh, she wants to get a job, too. I'm going to give her this first set. Oh, I don't know. I don't know if I want to give you that one. Oh, no, I don't want to give you that one. That's too many. That's too many. I don't want that many. They're, the freckles are layerable, too, so I have to be careful. That's cute. We're going to give you that one. And give you those and then Lilith really quick I'm gonna change her outfit this, she's gonna have the same outfit it's just a different color that I like to give her I really don't know why it's this exact color that whoever made this for her for the default buy clothes <laughs> yeah someone get the exterminator from Edgewood <laughs> Nah, no, I I mean, I, I don't think she's too goth for freckles. I don't think that, I think she would naturally have freckles just from having really light skin and red hair. I have freckles and I never see the, the sun, ever. And I have freckles across my nose. <laughs> get yourself an outfit. So let's get the outfit. It's way down at the end too, so it's going to take forever for us to scroll down there. <laughs> Yeah, I really like that hair on Angela, too. That's just the default replacement uh, for the new hair system that I got. And I didn't even change it. It looks really good. Nobody mentioned Spice Brown. Well, this is not a Pleasant Sims stream if somebody doesn't mention Spice Brown. Um, I can't because I haven't loaded these before. So I can't. I can do it, but it's still gonna. it's still going to drag. See? It's going to make me scroll through every page first. 
Yeah, I like the replacements. Yeah, we have to do all the secondary aspirations and stuff for this family, too. We're not going to be able to do everything tonight because I have, like, five minutes. I might wait. I think I'll wait to do the scenario until the next stream. That way we can start out on a bang. You know what I mean? It's been it's been mentioned now. <laughs> oh, thanks for the follow, Han. Um, and we'll just do we'll like we'll just do some maintenance stuff, and then next time we stream uh, Pleasant View, we can start out with the with the pleasant scenario. That'll be fun. Because I don't want to have to rush through it. I want us to take our time and really, really be able to savor the drama. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh my gosh, come on, come on. We're almost there. We're almost there. <laughs> that was not a pun. No pun intended. No pun intended on starting with a bang, but I'm, I'm happy it went that way. <laughs> It was an unintended pun, 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 pun. I don't know what I'm saying. Okay, so I'm gonna go with this one for her because I like the or the actually this I like this one the best for her. I always give her this one. That's so cute. I would have worn that when I was a teenager. Yes, please. Okay, it's going to take it a second. It's going to freaking scroll through everything. I'm not sure what I'm going to do every Wednesday. And I know I said, like, if you're in the Discord, I said I was going to tell you guys tonight what I was going to do Wednesdays. But I kept changing my mind, and I'm still th I'm still throwing it around. And um, whether or not I want to do a Sims 3 stream on Twitch or not. Um... Or if I want to do maybe even another Sims 2 hood. I don't know yet. I'm going to think on it some more. On what we're going to do on Wednesdays. And I'll let you know by next week. <laughs> Get yourself some spice brown. Okay, is it done? Come on now. Oh my gosh. Okay, it's done now. Now we can look at her outfit. And you can see how cute this looks. <laughs> thank you guys look how adorable she is I love it so much oh my gosh I love you Lilith I love you look how pretty she is and then also also Angela I love you too Angela just not as much as Lilith <laughs> so there's Angela they are they're so cute they're so cute and okay, and Mary Sue and Daniel, we've already done Daniel. Um, what else could we do? We could look at their lifetime once for Mary Sue and Daniel. Really quick like. Come on, get over here. Get over here. I'm having such a hard time controlling my game. What is up with that? Daniel is looking handsome though. He is looking really good. <laughs> Yeah, I thought about doing CC shopping. That would be that would be a way for me to actually get some CC shopping done too. Oh yeah, we need to do body hair for Daniel. That's a good point. And let me buy a sim blender. We're gonna give him just a light a light dusting, a light coating, a light coating of hair. <laughs> no, I love Angela too. I love Angela and Lilith. I do, but I love Lilith more. I can't help it. I can't help it. She's like my spirit sim, you know what I mean? <laughs> I did, I, you know what? I, I have the fire hydrant mod in my mods folder. I checked. I do. I have it in my mods folder. So do you guys see it here? Cause I don't. I don't know why it's not showing up. If you see it here, tell me, but I do not see it. And I definitely, that's like an urn. That's remains. I checked my mods folder because I was like, I know I downloaded that. And I totally did. It's in there. And it's supposed to be under miscellaneous, miscellaneous. But it is not here. So I don't know. Maybe there's some kind of load order issue. Um, if anybody knows, please tell me. Because it's definitely not here. 
Definitely not here. No pick. I don't see a no pick. Oh, down here? No. No, that's rack video games. That's not it. I don't see another no pick. Yeah. Not this no pick. I can't put it down because they don't have enough money. They're not, it's not 2,500 simoleons. Yeah, that's not it. Oh my God, you know what? I probably do only have the recolor. That's probably it. That's probably it. I'll go recheck the files again uh, later. I bet that's the problem. I bet you that's the problem. Oh, okay, let's do that. Um, do you see it here anywhere? I don't see it. I don't think I have it. I think I think Nick is right. I bet you that I only have the uh I bet you I only have the recolor. Silly me. Because I didn't realize it was a recolor. I thought it was just uh all one file. Cause I don't read. Obviously, I don't read. <laughs> Yeah, that's probably it. I'll go uh, check on that and then we can put those on all the lots Okay, we're gonna add we don't want to add bo body hair to Lilith. We want to add body hair to Daniel Oh, Daniel, you need to change your clothes, honey Change into something so we can see that bod Change into Swimwear. There we go. Oh, look at those. Look at those swim trunks And add body hair. Let's do a set two Mmm Oh, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. He's athletic, so he'll probably have, a, like, a more of a bear chest. Yeah. Um, no, I don't really use any category organizers. I just make my own collections. Because that helps me more. Um, but for, like, miscellaneous stuff, nah. I don't. Okay, let's get rid of this. We got that part done and it's just about time to end the stream so i think we're gonna wrap it up on that note guys and then the next so our next pleasant view stream we're gonna start right here with the pleasant family they're already made over and we can just start the drama right away i'm gonna save right now so we don't lose anything i am i'm leaving him in his swim trunks <laughs> So thank you guys so much for joining me. This was a really fun stream. I can't wait to get back to Pleasant View and finish this. And then I can't wait to start our rounds. That is going to be so much fun. I can't wait to get back to the Goth family and or the Lothario family. I'm sorry. They're not even the Goth family. They're lo the Lothario family. So what do we have going on? It's Wednesday. So on Friday, I'm going to have another video on YouTube for you guys. And then Saturday, we're doing channel members only live stream. So if you're one of my YouTube channel members at the live simmer level or above, we're going to have members only live stream. We're going to be playing Edgewood on Saturday. And then Sunday, I'll be back on Twitch with some more Asylum Challenge. So I can't wait for that, guys. And uh, I may even have another video on Saturday, but I'm not promising anything. I'm going to try. Um, and I think that's just about all I've got going on right now. Don't forget to follow me on all the sites. Follow me on Twitter. Follow me on Instagram. And come join our Discord as well. And I hope you guys all have a great night. I will see you very soon. I'm glad you like the Asylum Challenge. Oh, and also don't forget to subscribe to my second channel. I'm almost at 1,000 subscribers. I need like 25 more. Um, but subscribe to my second channel, Pleasant Streams. There is a link on my about page here on Discord, or you could just probably Google it and, uh, or search for it on YouTube. And that's where I'm going to be uploading my Twitch streams too, but they'll be there probably a day or two after the actual stream. You can watch them all back there. And that's it. That's all the plugs I got, guys. Have a great night. It was wonderful hanging out with you all again, and I'll see you very soon. Thank you. There's the link to the Discord right there in the chat. So if you haven't joined, come on over and join us. Bye, guys. Good night.